Hey. Hey there. Hey, 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 hey. We're going right in. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Oh my gosh, we're going one horror game right after another. First yesterday and now today. But I've heard crazy things about this one. Crazy things. Hi. How are you guys doing? It's a, it's a good day. It's a good day today. I feel like my sleep schedule is slowly, slowly getting worse. I don't know if it will recover from my time at Niji Sanji. I don't know. I feel like I am constantly on JST. So, huh, God, oh God. But that's okay, honestly. My, my, my sleep schedule works well with my stream schedule, at least I think right now. I think right now it does. <laughs> I hope you guys is better than mine at the very least. I feel like I've been waking up past noon and I never used to do that. I feel like I used to consistently wake up at like, gosh, nine, eight or nine AM. I have actually been turned into a gremlin by Niji Sanji. Niji Sanji, this is, this is their agenda. This is their agenda. This was their plan all along. They were trying to turn me into a gremlin. I mean, I, to be honest, I've always kind of been a gremlin, but it's okay. I slept relatively well though. It's just, I stay up late. <laughs> I swear I did. I used to be a morning person, but then I became a hero of the night, okay? There's nothing I can do. There's nothing I can do about it. It's just over with. My schedule's screwed. I've, I've accepted it, all right? I've accepted it. Although I have to fix it occasionally for some streams, because some people stream at earlier times. Time zones are a crazy thing, but it's all right. You, hey, if you don't believe me on my, on my being a morning person, that's up to you, okay? I used to be a hell of a morning person. I'd go to bed at midnight, and I would wake up at 8 or 9 a.m., Sometimes 10 at the latest. I used to get a headache if I stayed up past like 2 a.m. Now my body's just like, oh, here again. <sighs> We've accepted our fate. But yeah, I don't know. I just like order, you know? I like order. I like structure. I really like having a, uh, a set pattern. I enjoy that. I really like that, but... <sighs> This is the, this uh, this this life has has allowed me to be more free, and it's not good for me. <laughs> uh, and then I also had a period where I was waking up every day at the same time unintentionally, and I hated it. I think no matter what time I would go to bed, I would wake up at like 9 a.m. and it was the worst. I hated myself. Thank God that's over. I, I much prefer this over doing that. God, that sucked. But, but, but. I'm ready. I'm ready for this. I'm ready for this. Are you guys familiar with Layers of Fear at all? I know a couple of my senpai have streamed it in the past. But I'm excited. Hmm. How do you get over a fear of elevators? Just take some steps to avoid them. <laughs> you have these like ready to go. You have these like these you have you have these you have like you have a you have a, a magazine. And you're just, you're just, you're just cock, you're just, <laughs> you're just cocking your weapon. And then you're just like, all right, stream starts, bang. <laughs> Thank you for this super. Forgot most of it. Okay, well, I've never played this game or any of this series, so I'm excited. I'm excited. Okay, okay, so you've seen playthroughs, you're kind of familiar with the game. All right, that's fine. That's fine. Honestly, I think the thing I'm most excited about for this game is the fact that this game actually respects my PC. I feel like I don't have a very weak PC, but like all these, all these like more indie uh, titles that I've been playing, despite the fact that they're smaller and they're supposed to be like of lower quality. And when I say lower quality, I don't mean like bad games. I mean like, I mean like graphics wise, you know, they should be lower quality. They're still super intense on my PC. So I'm just like, uh, either I'm not optimizing them correctly or they're not optimized for, for like, I don't know. I don't know, I don't get it. But this this game, it seems like I can run it and it's gonna be super pretty. So we're gonna see everything in vivid detail and I'm so excited to like, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna see. I have, I have no idea what this game is about. I didn't do any research. So, I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't know, dude. I, look, guys, you don't understand. After, after debut, I upgraded like crazy. I had to. I had. I, I had no choice. I was like, okay, I need to. You know, I have a. I have a. I have a. I have a 3080. I, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not playing around. Like I take this. I take this seriously. I was like, okay, I can't. I can't. Like, like this is. This is not. This is not a game. So like, I. You know, like, I don't have a weak PC. 
I don't have a weak PC. So, I don't know. These I feel like these games are just not they're not, you know. I have 30 I have 32 gigabytes of RAM. I have 32 gigabytes of RAM. I have um I I don't know PC parts. So, you know. <sighs> And I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't have, I don't have, I don't know the names of parts. I just know that I have a 3080 and I have 32 gigs of RAM. That's it. So, like, I don't know. <sighs> Such is life, I guess. People always told me the magic didn't exist. I believed them until I saw your smile. Have a great stream. I know our brave crochet won't get scared once. Thank you. Thank you for believing me. And thank you for the super. <laughs> this, is, this is very, very riskful of you. <laughs> I don't know. I, 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 I. I, I don't I don't know what generation anything is. I have no idea. If you're if you're asking me about PC parts, uh, that is that is not my forte. I am not I am not tech savvy at all. I'm not tech savvy, guys. I still look down when I type. We've been over this. I'm not tech savvy. Okay. I don't know what anything is. I just know I just I remember the names. Uh, AMD Ryzen. Um, it's 3080 Ti. Uh, so, um. Yeah, I don't know, dude. I'm in a short circuit if I keep talking about this shit. <laughs> I am not tech savvy at all. You're gonna have to. You're gonna. You're gonna have to deal with me, okay? I am. I'm probably the least tech savvy of everyone in crisis. <laughs> oh my god. There's a reason why I like to keep it simple, okay? You do have a notebook full of puns. Oh my gosh. Hello, hello. Hope you rested well and your throat is feeling better. My joke of the day for you. What does a creepy Pokemon do while you're in the shower? <laughs> Pikachu. <laughs> That's that's a good one. I like that. I like that a lot. At least these are easy on my brain. Jokes are good, good jokes are easy on my brain. I have a risk for you, good sir. You got no paper and no pencil, but you're still you're still drawing my attention. <gasps> Yo! Holy heck. Wow! Wow. Wow. Okay. Alright. My gosh. He's a Rizzler. They're a Rizzler. A Riz Master. They have a PhD in Quantum Rizics. My god. My god. We got a Rizzly Bear in the house, folks. We got a Rizzly Bear. A Rizzly Bear in the crew. Oh my gosh. Okay. I like it. I like it. Powerful. <laughs> oh my gosh, the Riz is on point. I look, I, I hope, I hope we can all learn something from one another, and that we can all have Riz. I, I want all of the Vanta crew to have Riz. We, we will have unparalleled, unmatched Riz. Okay. One of these days, I'll have to teach you guys uh, all my studies that I've had about Riz. Okay. I'll have to teach you everything so that you too can be Rizzlers. You two can have a uh, have a, have a have a degree in quantum physics, rizology, rizography, everything, everything. Okay. Yeah, you gotta you gotta you gotta, you gotta up your studies. I'll help you out. I gotta help you out at some point. <laughs> they say the PC reflects the owner. Yeah, my PC is pretty sexy. Understandable, to be honest with you. <laughs> Thank you for the super. Gunba Venta Crow, Fearless Bringer. I'm ready for another cozy horror stream. This game is one of my faves. Oh, is it? Oh, Pog. Okay, well, I've heard really good things about this one, so I'm not surprised that it would be a lot of uh, a lot of people's favorites. <laughs> thank you for thank you for the super. Yeah, yeah, you know, it'll be okay. What do you mean? Look, being be whether you're sexy or not is all up in your head. Okay, you have to you have to you have to believe that shit. Sexiness is related to Riz. Unparalleled confidence and the ability to believe in yourself no matter what is true Riz. That is Riz. Riz is inside of you. Riz is within you. You have it, just like everyone else. Everyone has it. There are certain external uh, factors that are out of our control that uh, affect our, our Riz levels or lack thereof, but you can make up for those. You can make up for your lack that, that others might have or that you feel others have. It's very possible. It's very possible. You got. You just have to believe in yourself. Yeah, exactly. Fake it till you make it. But 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 but, but I don't want to give away all this all the secrets, okay? Or all the teachings right now. All right, all right. I don't want to give away everything. I gotta I gotta I gotta prepare I gotta prepare a course for you. I gotta prepare a course so that you guys can you guys can truly understand. You have to 
so you can truly get it, okay? One of these days, one of these days. They call Dizzy Rizzy for a reason. So Vanta, you that Albert Einstein said, wait, you know that Albert Einstein said, there's nothing fast in lightning, but he hasn't seen how fast I fell for you. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I think I need a heart rate monitor on because every time I open your stream, my heart starts to race. Is this what it is to Riz? <laughs> yes, yes, thank you for the supers. If you carried Medusa's curse, I would still gl I would still stare into your eyes, so my stone body could gaze at perfection for eternity. Oh my God! Oh my God! Okay, all right, all right. Who's who's teaching the class here? Maybe maybe it doesn't need to be me. Maybe maybe it needs to be some of y'all. Goodness gracious! Passing with flying colors. What is this? We've got. Oh my God! Thank you for the supers, by the way. Sheesh. Okay, alright then. Fine, we, we got some rosers in here. I, I, I'll hand it to you. I'll hand it to you. Alright, alright. I see you. I see you. I like it. I like it. I'm here for it. Oh, and speaking of heart rate monitor, you just reminded me. Thank you for saying something. <sighs> oh, yeah, that's a great idea. Okay. Surprise teachers. There's act there's actually some uh, some some teachers assistants uh, in the class today uh, Apparently they are showing themselves and proving themselves to be true Rizzlers They are they are def they are definitely worthy of the title. That's impressive. I'm very impressed Huh, huh. Wow, that's that's some powerful. That's powerful. I'm a fan Whoa. Okay, that's fine. All right I got my heart rate monitor. Let's let's um uh, let's go in. Let's go in. I, I I like I like going in on that high note. Everybody say goodbye to Kurokoko. Say goodbye. Say good night. That song is gonna be stuck in my head, and I hate myself. All right, let's grow. Let's crow, baby. We got we got we got professional wrestlers in the house, so we're gonna go in on that note. Okay, so also Venta. Your name isn't actually Google, because you are everything I'm looking for. <laughs> they just get more and more powerful. All right, y'all, y'all gotta, y'all gotta cool it down. Gonna be taking away my job. All right, all right. I'm gonna turn on the sound. Tell me if this is too loud, okay? Is this loud at all? It's the menu music that's playing. Do you hear it? And thank you for the super, by the way. You can teach. Right now it's okay. Sounds okay. Alright, it is lower than normal because you know you want it to be you want it to have a little bit of sound, you know? A little bit of pizzazz. Um let me see. Where is Is it this? Yeah, it is that. Okay, okay, okay. Um Let me turn this on. Connect. Does this work? Let me see. It says it's connected, so we should be good. Oh, there it is. Okay, Pog. Nice. We have a heart rate monitor. All right, I'm gonna play around with stuff though, just to make sure that everything's in its place. So, yeah, okay, perfect. You ever heard of Vanta Black? It's one of the darkest materials and absorbs pretty much all light and radiation, but I guess it doesn't apply to you since your eyes shine with so much purple light. <sighs> All right, all right, all right, Sean. All right, all right, I said to cool it down. I said to cool it down, but it seems we can't. Is the game too loud? Okay, it's too loud. Thank you for telling me. What about here? Another thing about it, I could just turn down the game. Oh, you know, I could turn it back off, and then I could actually turn the game on. What about now? How about now? Because I'm up right now. Also, thank you for the super. Better now? You like this? Okay. Okay, but is it too quiet? Is it perfect or is it quiet? Because there's a difference. We need it to be good, you know, okay? We need it to be immersive. I don't I don't want to ruin I don't want to ruin our immersion because it's too because it's too quiet. Okay, it's it's perfect? It's it's perfect? Okay, good now? Not quiet? Okay, fantastic. Thank you for the feedback. I appreciate it. Okay. 
Um, oh, there's a DLC. Oh, hmm, I wonder. Maybe we'll maybe we'll take a look at that if uh, if time permits. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Oh, I forgot I'm not. All right, cool. But yeah, see, this is what I was talking about. Look, I can actually run everything on high and there's no lag, no lag at all. Like, like th that's how you know that this game is optimized. It's optimized well. I like it. Okay. All right. Heard a lot of things about this game. Heard it's kind of spooky, a little bit on the spooky side, but we can vibe. I'm a little scared. I mean, anxious. Anxious is a better word. All right. <sighs> okay. Okay. Yeah, you guys can hide behind me, okay? You, you have nothing to fear. You have nothing to fear. Sorry if things are in the way, by the way. I'll move stuff as, uh, as fast. I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. Oh, damn, okay. But even for you, there is still a way. Really? A way to bring it all back. Was it loud? The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Finish it. And what about now? Should be a bit quieter. Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist, not of the sitter. You think this guy sounds like me? No way. Oh, we're here. Okay, this is the game. The voice is the voice sounds like mine? No way. Really? Okay. Uh, I lowered it a bit. Tell me if it. Tell me if it's loud again. Okay. Is there anything we can act, interact with in here? Nothing. Not this book. Oh, so you can zoom in. Is there sprint? Probably can't sprint yet. Yeah, there's no sprint. How's the sensitivity, by the way? Is the sensitivity okay? Is this? Uh, this feels a little fast. Let's go to controls, mouse sensitivity. Let's lower that just a bit, see what it does. Oh, was it fine? Actually, I think this is better. I think this is perfect. Yeah, this is like, I think this is, this is Gucci. Okay. All right. Yeah, I think this game is just loud. The sound design must be phenomenal. Are they? Yeah, let me go to the, cause all I did was lower that. Let me lower these, lower this here too. Oh, I see. Interesting. That's how you open a door. Okay. Hopefully this sound should be fine now. Alright. Bro, that is too bright. Is that a bell? Long... Dale... Ma... Whoa. Fuck. I can't read that. Longdale, Michigan? Longdale, Mid... Uh, is that Michigan? Mulligan? Long... Longdale, Mulligan, Av... Alright, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I actually... I can't see. It's not that I can't read. I can't see it. I can't see the words. The, the thing, okay? It's not my fault. Dear sir, we would like you we would like to ask you to cease bothering our pest control specialist, as well as refrain from sending us any more of your highly inappropriate letters. I'll have you know that my mother is a respectable woman and does not take kindly to such accusations. All of our employees that visited your house reported absolutely no signs of a rodent infestation of any kind, and as such decided not to act further than a prophylactic spraying. Please treat this letter as a final warning, or else the next envelope you'll receive will be from our lawyers. With best regards, Carl Denton. Pesky Pest Pacification Company. Oh. Uh. So apparently, we've been doing some bad shit. 
We got fine china. God, I love that song. I want to go listen to it now. Math is so confusing. It's always talking about X and Y, but never you and I. I'm loving all the Riz in this in this chat. In this chat tonight. The Vanta crew are all Rizzlers. Maybe we should just change that. We should just be the Vanta Rizzlers now. I'm gonna change change the fan name. Sir, I didn't thank you for the super by the way. Sir, I didn't touch the didn't touch the witch stop, just like you asked. Although I can't imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Have a nice day. Yo, we are... We are not... What is this? This door okay? Oh, that's downstairs. We're gonna not bother that right now. What's this? Why is it so dark? Oh, because I need to clean my monitor. Wait, is this running? Bro? This guy's embarrassing. Who, who, who are we? Achilles prosthetics? Oh, we have a prosthetic. Who are we playing as? This guy is like... Oh, it's so dark. What is this? Toilet? Oh. Ain't nothing. There's not really anything in any place. Huh. Oh, can is there a sprint? Yeah, there is. Sprint works. Okay, I thought it didn't work. Kind of does. What the hell? I figured you'd be up all night, so I made you a little treat, you know? I bet even Rembrandt occasionally took time off from being brilliant and shoved his head off like the rest of us common folk. I know you... I know... Gasp. In other words, get some sleep, you big dummy. I love you. Damn, this is like most of my friends. Wild. More Riz. More Riz in my supas. Oh, is there anything in there? If there's nothing I can grab in here, then what's the point in exploring? Nothing. Okay. Alright then. Oh, I know. Somebody did actually write Gasp. What is this door? It's just pitch black in here, dude. I can't see anything. Uh, okay. I'll just come in here later. There's nothing I can see. There's not even like a switch or anything. No, nothing. Okay. We'll just close that. That's nice, though. That's really good. If it's really dark, that's gonna be fantastic. I can't wait. It means light's gonna be super important in this game. Oh! <laughs> well, I guess that answers that question. Where are the light switches then? Where the hell are the light switches? Is there one on the wall? Yeah, okay. That explains a lot. I swear there wasn't a light switch, dude. Okay, whatever. Might as well turn off the lights. No, there's nothing in here. I'll just go up the stairs. Yeah, we've got a lot of people concerned about us, and we've done some really not great things, apparently. Oh, don't want to leave the light on. That's a waste of electricity. Okay. Also, I didn't say thank you for the super. Did that just close? Or did that open? I can barely see, it's so damn dark. What the heck? Is this a hallway? Or are those stairs? What? Mm. This is a nice house, though. 
Oh, it's music. Music, things I can't read. Okay. Uh, okay, that kind of that kind of spooked me. Huh. Okay. Been working all night. Don't wake me up. Oh. Okay. Alright then, I'm gonna leave them alone. Well, my curiosity is getting the better of me. Wait. But they're listening to music? And the lights are on. Weird. Not, there's not even anybody in bed. Disastrous fire at the new at the new department store leaves dozens fighting for their lives. The long-awaited opening for the galactic department store turned into hell on earth when the building's ring when the building's wiring burst into flames. While the majority of the visitors managed to reach the emergency exits in time, several unfortunate attendees were trapped in the back of the building, having no chance to escape the raging inferno. The exact number of casualties has not yet been determined, although it is estimated that at least a dozen people have been severely injured. The owner of the Galactic. Ronald Sheffield has so far declined to comment on today's tragic events. Damn, I mean, what are you supposed to say? Oh? Well, that's pretty. That's gorgeous. Oh my gosh. This game looks so good. I mean, I guess it's 2016, so it's not long. It's not like it was a long time ago, but like still. This game still looks hella good. Sorry I couldn't sleep. The leg's been acting up. Figured I might as well do some work. Love you. Okay. Is there anything in here? God, that got me so bad. What the heck is that painting? Is there a light switch? There is. Okay. Bro, what is that painting? Is that... Is that Chewbacca? What is that? Is that a baby? Baby Chewbacca? Anything. Oh, I got a key. I'm sorry, I'll make it up to you. Tonight is about you and me. Let's make it special. You promised. Okay. Oh. Oh, is it Red Riding Hood? Oh. Wait, what? What? Huh? Huh. Okay. Somebody must have drew that. That's not... Just gotta keep all the lights on. I like the lights being on, actually. I like being able to see. Okay. I guess there's nothing in these rooms. Anything? True story. The picture of Dorian Gray. Was it Trell along? Dorian Gray. When did this game take place? Need to know. Because I feel like there's a lot of names, like Rembrandt, uh, Dorian Gray... Robert Sheffield, right? I, I recognize these names, but only vaguely. Oh. My dear friend, let me ask you one simple question. Have you completely lost your goddamn mind? I know you're going through some rough times right now. I really do. That's why I've agreed to let you do those illustrations in the first place. For old times' sake. I even deliberately gave you a trivial task because I expected Little Red Riding Hood to be something you can draw in your sleep. What I didn't expect is to get this demented nightmare fuel you submitted for a kid's bedtime story. There's no way in hell I'm using this, and I already regret agreeing to a payment in advance. Please get your shit together. Your old pal, Liam Brickstone. Oh, damn, wait. So, wow, did we draw this? Wow, okay. We're clearly not okay. We are, we are not having a good time. 
Why are there- why is there a staircase leading to... That's so weird. Okay. That's got a lock on it. Wait, I do have a key. Can I use it? Her house is like empty, bro. Is there anything? Huh. It's interesting toys for, uh... I mean, you know, people can play with whatever they want. Huh. Interesting. Oh? oh I thought this was keys. That's pretty. Anything in here? Anything? Is there a crouch button? There's not. Okay. At least not yet. Okay. Well, I have a key. Oh. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Is that the key to the room downstairs? If it's not this door. Well, the way you go upstairs is so realistic. Is it this door? Okay, maybe it's the one from downstairs. Huh. Thank you so much. I will take that good luck. What are these images? Oh, oh, that's why. Okay, so maybe you're right. We are a painter. Yeah, because like some of this stuff is just. Yeah, like why are we drawing babies? Why are we drawing like grown babies? Like, look, like what is that? Why, why? Why would you, why? Okay, I mean, I guess. Okay, is it this door? Oh, it is this door. Oh, is it like our painting room or whatever? I didn't close that. Get it right this time. Oh shit. Oh. Okay, so this is taking place like very old timey. I can tell by his outfit. God. Anything in here? So yeah, we're definitely a painter. I guess we're not doing so hot. So many brushes. Okay. Lost. Lost, you deserve it. Finish it. There's something I'm supposed to grab. Do I sit down? What? There, can I turn this over? No. Nothing. What about anything? Is there anything that I can grab? Painting tools. Oh, there's a drawer. Oh. I'm so sick and tired of us talking through these notes. We live in the same house, for God's sake. Come talk to me when you're done before you go to sleep. Whoa. Yeah, this guy's not doing too hot. Like, at all. Like, his... Uh, I'm assuming he's got a relationship. He did have that note on his desk where, like, it was like, tonight's gonna, you know, tonight's our night, let's make it special, you promised. This guy might be, like, a struggling artist that, like, and his relationships are suffering as a result of his lack of ability to do his job. You know, like, when you, when you have, when you have work that you're passionate about and you're not doing well, that can cause, like, low self-esteem and it really affects your, really affects your personal life in a negative way. Maybe he doesn't feel like he deserves his, uh, his wife anymore. If if that's if that's who he has in his life, I'm assuming. Especially artists. 
I feel like artists and creatives in particular are very, uh, are very, uh, what's the word? They are very prone, not prone to it, but I feel like their, their likelihood of getting something like depression increases. They always tell you never compare, never compare your work, never compare your work, but like, that's the only way you can grow. Being an artist is hard, dude. Where are we going? Like, you have to compare your work to others in order to actually get better at art, but they tell you never to compare your work or else it'll <laughs> mess up your mental. That seems so unfair. The life of an artist. Huh. What? What are we doing? How? What am I supposed to do? Do this? Oh. Finish it. Okay. But... I don't... Can I... You know, I can't do anything. Why don't I just leave? This is a hallway. Shit. Okay. What's this on the floor? Oh, these doors keep... Oh. Oh my gosh, my game. Am I supposed to touch anything in here? Oh, oh my god! Holy shit! <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, we're just okay. Am I supposed to see something? I don't see anything. Yeah, I might touch the 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 brightness just a bit. Adjust the 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 brightness by moving the slider until the portrait is barely visible. The portrait? There we go. What? Okay, there we go. All right, I can see a bit better now. Just a bit. Like, I literally couldn't see anything. It was actually pitch black. It was impossible to see. That's why. I, I had the dark. I had the brightness set to too dark. I might lower it just a bit more, though. Because I can still... Probably, like, right there. Yeah, because now I can barely see it. Okay, that's better. I don't want it to be too bright. I just needed enough so that I can actually make things out. Because I can't see anything. <laughs> Oh. Am I getting steam achievements? I keep hearing the sound. Going in circles. Oh yeah, this is definitely a depressed artist. Dear sir and madam, we must kindly, albeit strongly, urge you to keep your voices down during the night. Your marital problems, while regrettable, are a private matter and should remain that way. They are certainly of no concern to us, and especially our children. Please consider that not everyone is a freelance artist. Yup. Yup. There it is. Some of us have to get up early and work for a living. We need our sleep. We must also warn you that if things continue the way they are now, we will be forced to call the police. Sincerely, your very tired neighbors. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no, this is so sad. I wonder what this game's about. Oh, Siri, what the f- Bro! Why? Why? Oh. Oh my gosh. Fuck. <laughs> oh my god. What did I even say? <sighs> Siri wanted to jump scare me too. My god. Oh. 
save the date. Request the pleasure of her company to celebrate their wedding on Saturday. Oh, a wedding. Two o'clock in the afternoon. Interesting. Nothing in there. Oh, nothing, I guess. Was there a light switch? Nope, doesn't look like it. Anything? No. Oh, are they, is this is this us? Is this us and our like spouse? The hell is this painting? Looks like a crazy kind of massage. Oh, nice. I can see. <sighs> Holy shit. 854. Okay. The past holds back. Look closer. The most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, will you marry me? Whoa! That's a good ass line. The most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, will you marry me? Oh, that's a that's a good one. That's cute. So, what do we do? Oh. Oh god. Oh no, this is terrible. Wait, what if like... You've been snooping around my workshop again. For the last time, you are not allowed in that room. Even if the door happens to be open, I forbid it. This is your last warn warning. Next time, you'll have to look for a new job. Oh. Oh god, this is terrible. What if this is like about a guy that's that's like fighting his demons in regards to like his relationship with his wife? <gasps> or what if he what if he killed her? Oh <gasps> no. This was rocking. Why do people have these in their house? Why? 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 Okay. <sighs> what the? Oh my god! Holy shit, dude. Fuck. God, I thought that was one of those new, like, fangled 3D billboards or something. Holy shit. Dust mice, even in my lungs, there's always more grotesque vermin dirt. What? What does this mean? It's so dark, I can't see anything. Turn on the light. Oh my god! Holy shit! I just wanted to see. Oh my gosh. My love, even though you have not been born yet, I can already feel your presence. It's simply amazing. I just can't believe how lucky I am. A year ago, all I had was talent and ambition. Now, against all odds, I have a career, a loving husband, and you. I have never been a deeply religious person. I guess what other people look for, look for in a sermon I found in perfecting my art. But now, I can't help but feel like there's a higher power watching over me. 
They once told me that I would never succeed as a musician. As a musician, now I'm playing sold-out concerts at some of the most prestigious venues in the country. They also said I had a difficult character and that I would never find a soulmate. Guess again. Finally, a doctor once told me that I would never be able to have children of my own, and yet here you are, within me. I am quite possibly the happiest woman in the world. I love you so much. Aww. So that was our wife. That was our spouse. In the image of uh, when she was playing piano. I see now. Okay. Okay, so so literally, it's two musicians fighting. Fighting. Uh, it, it's a, it's a not so not so happy couple right now. Okay. All right. Oh, we're back in this room. Oh, this painting's here, and now the baby's up there. Oh, God. Oh! Now I'm thinking maybe the wife had a miscarriage or something, and they're fighting over that. And that's what that's the strain in their relationship. That would explain why he drew Little Red Riding Hood getting killed. Maybe he's taking his aggression out on his art. He's drawing his emotions. What the fuck, dude? Do I... Holy shit. Huh. Okay. It's this same area right there that's messed up. Oh my god! This is a. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> you think this guy sounds like me? There's no way. He doesn't sound like me. Nah. Nah. That's a beautiful figure drawing, though. No, he does not sound like me. Don't say that. He does not. They just went into the fire and die? Oh my god. That rat was not having it. Oh. Wait, is the goal to find all the rats and make them burn? It doesn't look like we can grab anything. Am I just supposed to go around the room? Oh. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, there's nothing to interact with. Or perhaps I just sit in the chair? Holy shit. What? Oh my god! Fuck, dude. This freaking game. Was this painting even here before? I don't even know, dude. I'm leaving. Holy shit.
anything. Hey, in regards to your previous letter, I'm sure it's nothing to be too concerned about. Women tend to get weird after having a baby, hormone imbalances and the like. When we had our first, I remember Valerie got the blues real bad. I would ask her what she wanted for lunch and she'd just burst into tears. Just be there for her and I'm sure it's going to be fine. Now I know I promise uh, not to rush you and by all means enjoy your well-deserved time off. But just to let you know, I'm getting phone calls up the yin-yang, commissions left and right. You're a hot ticket, my friend. We should strike the iron while it's hot. But of course, family comes first. Your friend and agent, Thomas Caldwell. Okay, so maybe the baby was born. Maybe it wasn't a miscarriage. But something definitely happened. Something definitely not good happened. Why is there a candle here? This is going to start a fire. Oh. Interesting. Oh, no. It's locked. Oh, is that a key? Hello. It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times, and yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. What? She's crying in the room. Do I have to go find a key, maybe? Oh, okay. I guess it's this way. Oh, fuck, dude. I can't see anything. Is there a light? Oh. Fuck, dude, fuck. Oh, come on, why does this hallway go further? Ah. Oh. Mmm. Please. First step is the hardest. Back in the kitchen? Okay. This place looks nicer than it did the first time. Oh, we got a scale. We have to make something. Oh, this isn't good. Oh, shit. Maybe there's stuff in here this time. No. No. It's actually clean. Oh, this is the past. This is the past. This has to... What the fuck, dude? Please! I t uh. Oh? Minced mice staring me out. Chunky... Gr grum? Grumpy? Grunchy? Grouchy? Carcasses constantly sick. Oh, chunky, crunchy carcasses. Starving me constantly sick. Oh, interesting. Oh, is there a key I have to look for, perhaps? What? What the fuck, dude? Oh, gosh. Fuck. Oh! Oh, sh- Uh! I, where do I go? Where do I go? Where do I go? In here? I don't- Wait. First, 
I looked for. Holy shit! Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hand steady. <sighs> what? Oh, God. What is that? These clothes? the pain that's the one we saw before oh my god is there anything else in here nothing oh it was all the way to the back Deep breaths. Remember, you're a professional. It's just the first few strokes, then you're over the hump. What's so hard about it? Hate. Even now. Lost. You deserve it. Finish it. Ah! Uh, what? What the hell? Are those flamingos? Those are some weird ass looking flamingos. The mice. Shapeless dreams. <sighs> Fuck. What? An elevator? What the hell, dude? What the f- Who is that? Past catches up? What? rooms, dude. Oh my god. Oh, fucking course, dude. Don't you know this is bad feng shui to, like, just have a, uh, a... They're all locked. This one open? Dear sir, while I can certainly understand that you are upset, and I have nothing but sympathy for your wife and yourself, I must categorically state that I do not wish to receive any further correspondence from you in this matter. Any skin graft procedure is extremely complicated and inherently associated with the risk of failure. Having stated that, I assure you that me and my colleagues at St. Anne have made every effort to ensure a positive outcome for your wife. Personally speaking, I believe we have done the best job possible considering the extent of tissue damage. Tissue damage? What happened? You are, of course, entitled to your opinion, and I can certainly understand your disappointment. What I do not understand is how you seem to think writing hateful letters to me or my fellow doctors will ameliorate the situation. As I've already stated, I can certainly understand you've been under a lot of stress as of late. And thus, I will not press charges if you refrain from any further correspondence. 
Let me make it absolutely clear that I will not tolerate any further threats aimed at my staff, my family, or myself. If you wish to seek psychological help, I can have my assistant provide contact information for several specialists who would be more than competent to help you get through these hard times. With regards and best wishes for you and your wife. William H. Green, M.D. So we've been sending, so we've been sending mean letters, awful letters to St. Anne because apparently, because of a botched procedure on our, oh fuck, oh jeez, I hope I, I hope it, I don't get flagged for that, damn it. This is, is this the same place we were in? Why did you stop? That dude was perfect. Honey, please, just a little longer. At least until I finish painting this one part. Oh, don't make me beg. What? What? Oh, no. Oh, God. Shit. She must have got, like, the Venom symbiote on her or something like that. Fuck. What do you normally need skin grafting for, though? Shit. Oh, I have to go back on the elevator, please! Do I? What? Where do I go? Oh! For burns! <gasps> Maybe she was in that fire. Where? Oh my god, I just, I don't even know what to do. Hmm. Oh. Oh shit. Nah, she, she, she has to be in that fire. I bet she was in that fire. She was in the fire that we read about, remember? At the place? Robert Sheffield. No. No. No, I don't think so. Shit. Shit. Are you fucking kidding me, bro? Why? 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 Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Huh. Jesus. Huh. Yeah, I've heard a lot of good things about this one. Also, hello. Hello, Mr. Toast. Oh, fuck, dude. I don't want to go up the stairs. I'm not afraid of exercise or anything, but Jesus. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, there was a fire. She was in the fire. Our wife was in the fire. She was in the fire for sure. Maybe our child didn't die? What the fuck? Nah, 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 nah. I'm gonna go over here instead. What's down there? There's nothing here. Can't go anywhere. Okay. Fine. Fine then. What happened to her? Oh. Wait. Oh my god! What? What? I'm closing it! 
fuck, dude? <laughs> just get me out. I just want to leave the house. Fuck with these rats, dude. Huh. <sighs> Warning signs, the following list is a completion of the most common symptoms of schizophrenia. While typically diagnosed between the ages of 15 and 25, the disorder is known to affect older patients as well. Note that these symptoms are not exclusive to schizophrenia and should by, should by no means be treated as conclusive evidence of this particular affliction. In order to obtain a proper diagnosis, you should, you should contact a qualified specialist. Psyche, psychologist, psychiatrist. 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 Well, no. Blank expression stares up into space, involuntary facial movements, insomnia... Unusual gestures or postures. Unable to experience joy from activities. Definitely. I mean, maybe you're maybe you're just an artist. Depersonalization. What does that even mean? Awkward, clumsy movements. Might be from the accident. More passive aggressive. Lack of motivation. Suicidal tendencies. Huh. I don't know. Schizophrenia. Are, is this... So... Make up your mind. God, this optic... Oh. Huh. I can't go in here. Okay. I guess not. Oh, it's a trap. Oh, that's bricks. Okay. What's this? Anything in here? Nothing. Okay. This room again? Oh no, it's a lot bigger this time. Okay. Why? Where? Nothing. Anything in here? Hmm. In the door? Hmm. Okay. I guess nothing then. Oh. 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 Wait, when did this candle turn on? What? Turn on. When did this candle get lit? Oh, what about this? Oh. Are there more lights? Okay, I thought that would do something. I guess not. I can see better now, but... I guess not. The hell is that? What is that painting? Oh my god! <laughs> what? <gasps> Shit! What was that? What was that? Holy shit. Oh, wait. There was something behind that painting. Oh, I don't know the combination. How do I, f how do I find it? Oh my god, dude! Holy shit! <laughs> Why? Why? Maybe the combination is somewhere in here. Or no, maybe it's. On a letter or something in a drawer. Over here. No. 
Mm. Fuck. Oh, one. That that one six five. That's one, right? Yeah, that's one six five for sure. Wait, one six five. One sixty five. Wait. Is that? Can you, can you, can you put that kind of combination in this? What? One six five. Like. Yeah, no, I I can only do. Ten sixty fifty. You know, I actually that might not. Oh shit! I don't know how to use one of these things. I have no idea how to use one of these, at all. Oh, oh, it worked. Well, thank goodness, because I never would have figured that out. I did that completely by accident. I just remember left, right, left, right. Nah. Nah. Oh, fuck, dude. March 26th. Alright, let's try this again. Finally managed to play a little. If banging on the keys awkwardly counts as playing. I won't lie, it drives me insane to not have full control of my fingers. In any case, I was promptly berated by my loving husband, who said I should be resting. I know he means well, but how will I ever get better if I don't work at it? The worst thing is I could sw I could swear I smelled liquor on his breath. God, please, not this again. Whoa. So I guess this is a letter I wouldn't have seen had I not gotten the combination and just moved on. Interesting. Huh. I wonder what happened then. Now I'm wondering what happened, because it seems like his wife survived the fire and she had to get skin grafts. But, like, what's the problem? Okay. Huh. Okay. Nice. What is that? Dude, these, these, I keep getting prompts for Steam, like, achievements or whatever, or trophies or something, and I, they are making me suffer. I, I they keep shocking me. Steam is the ultimate jump scare. Oh, wait. No? Okay. Good God. Is that it? Why did that painting, like, melt? What is this? What are what what? What does that say? Is I don't want to walk in there. I don't want to walk in there. I don't want to walk in there. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. It's like distorted. What does this even say? Uh, un undone. It cannot be undone. It cannot be undone. That's all it says. What can't be undone? Oh, shit!
gonna. Can I go back in there? Holy shit. Ah. Uh. <sighs> Oh, it's just a dog. Where is the good boy? It's a painting. Oh, shit. Holy shit. What? Ah. Uh, what's over here? Good boy. What? What are you trying to do? You're trying to get on my good side? Is that what your plan is? Well, it's not gonna work. It's not gonna work, Layers of Fear. Oh. Anything. Oh. Remember how you said it would be nice to have a cat so the baby could have someone to play with? Well, I just bought us a dog. <laughs> oh. Wait. Did the dog burn in the fire too? Who who all burned in the fire? What? Oh shit. Oh no! This fire took everything from us! You want this as well? Want what? Is there anything to click on? No? Well, I didn't do much. Oh. A once great artist. Once great artists, new paintings laughed out of galleries. What we witnessed today, while entirely worthless in artistic terms, might be an invaluable case study for psychologists. These harsh words came from none other than Jason Hughes, the famed critic of... The famed critic was one of the first to appreciate the works of blank and whose praise once contributed to his first spectacular success. When asked if such brutal criticism was indeed called for, especially in light of the recent tragic events, Hughes responded, As critics, it is our duty to critique art, but not to judge the artist. The man has been through a lot lately, and obviously it has taken a toll on him. Still, if we were to remain silent and pretend this is even remotely acceptable, we would be doing the artist a disservice. Other critics were only slightly more lenient, as... Oh, no. Hmm... It's the vase again. Nothing. Nothing again. Nope. Okay. This sprint button is just fake. They just want me to feel like I can run. I know that I can't. Okay, okay. I can't move forward. I'm gonna turn around and something's gonna do something. But I'm prepared for it. I'm prepared for it. I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid! Oh. See, there really wasn't anything. Oh my god! Fucking one two one two. Oh my god! Oh shit! 
Stupid. <laughs> what? Nah, nah, I'ma wait. Do they both lead the same way? Oh, sh fuck. <gasps> what? Oh, oh, sh oh my God, dude. <sighs> Huh. Oh my god, dude. Nothing in here. Okay. Oh, shit. Come on, bro. Oh! Okay. Key. Oh, shh. We just turned on the other light. Uh. Uh. What? We turn on the other light. Turn it back on. What are they doing? April 6th. Found his little collection of empty bottles this morning. I reacted badly. I know it's time for him too, but god damn it, he should know better. With a small child in the house. That's just irresponsible. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go see where this one leads. Oh. oh. This house is absolutely amazing. Oh, but those stairs. With that leg of mine, I think you'll have to carry me to the bedroom once we move in. So this is Arcane. Holy shit, dude. All right. What is this? What even is happening? Oh, no, I can't turn that on. Okay, sick. That door's not closing behind me? Well, this is our bedroom from before. Is there an item to pick up here? Honey, what in the world are you doing? What did the doctor say about straining yourself? Leave that thing alone. It's not going anywhere. He doesn't sound like me. Oh, a record. Oh. Wrong way. Oh. What? What the f Huh. <sighs> okay. I needed a 
jar and a plastic tube. <sighs> I siphoned gas before. I knew how it was done. I stuck the tube in a vein and sucked on it until blood filled my mouth. Then put the tube in the jar and it just kept coming. The taste of copper haunted me the entire night. What? Why didn't I think of a syringe? Yeah, why would you just drink that? Oh, shit. Prosthesis. Oh, yeah, we have a prosthetic leg. That's why we have the cane. Shit, we need all new furniture. Can I even leave? I can't even leave. Wait. Wait, is there... A... Wait. Ah, oh, what's the bottle though? Can I can I drink it now? Okay, not that one. Where? Okay. Maybe I just don't know what to do. <sighs> we have this bottle. Nothing. Does it play the same thing every time? It plays the same thing every time. Mmm. Oh, fuck. I can't get anywhere. I can barely see anything. That's the violin. I didn't know if I can turn it the other way. Yeah, I can't. I can't turn it the other way. Hmm. So wait. Do I have to spin it one way to make it play correctly? Maybe. Oh. Oh. Huh. Look at that, guys. I did it. Wait, was that bus there the whole time? Look, everything's fine. It's back to normal, see? You guys were worried for nothing. Is this the right way? Oh, it's this again. Huh. I can't stand seeing you like this. You're not well. You were sweating and shaking all night. Now there you are, locked in your workshop, as usual. The whole tortured artist nonsense has got to stop. Huh. You don't seem to look much different. But we've lost all of our stuff now. Oh, this is open now. First, I look for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Oh, no, we've read this before. Wow. 
What are we drawing? It looks like something out of Soulsborne. Oh, stop looking at me like that. It's just a little something to help me focus on my work. That's all. Oh. What did he do in, in a drunken rage? He did something that he regrets. <sighs> Fuck, dude. Oh! What the heck? That vase has been kept intact this entire game, and then suddenly... Fuck, dude. This shit ain't cheap. Now suddenly there's music playing. Okay. Maybe he's the one that burnt the Galactic. Maybe he's the one that burnt it. I have no idea. Clearly he did something. He did something bad. He... Oh my god. Fuck. Oh, fuck. What? Can I... Can I get around? No, I can't. Alright, then. I can't. Wait. Oh, okay. So I can see. What is this? Uh huh. Where? Oh, wait. What was that? Haunting mimics. Knock, knock, knock. Not gonna let them in. Only clothes left behind. Hmm. He's definitely the problem. We're definitely the problem. This dude's angry about something. Huh. Oh! What the heck? That's the first time we've seen something! Okay, okay, alright, alright. At first, I was thinking maybe it was like schizo or schizophrenia or something. Maybe the maybe the, the the diagnosis was correct, but no. Okay, now there's something actually here. Creator's block. Okay. Please, please, I'm begging. Okay, you're not gonna get me this time. What? Now I know there's gonna be something here. Nothing? Just a, just a creepy room? What? What? Oh my god! What? What was it for? Oh my gosh. What happened on the ninth again? Oh my god, dude. What happened on the ninth again? What happened? I don't remember. Is, there, is the key in here? No. Oh my gosh, dude. <sighs> okay. All right. September 15th. More notes today. Even worse than before. The sad part is I agree with every word. Oh, wait. Is that incomplete letter that's in the room with us? That says, like, I hate even more? Maybe that's our letter. 
Is this the wife writing this? There's something wrong with us. Oh shit. What the? Huh? You saw that thing moving, didn't you? No, you- no. no. What the fuck? Somebody taking a shower? No. <sighs> Ugly. Ugly. Oh my Ugly. god. You ordered a true portrait. So that's where I painted you fucking plant. Maybe I need to kick some artistic sense into your stupid face! That's crazy. He went from saying fucking pleb to stupid face. This guy is all over the place. What is this? He needs to stay profanatively consistent. Shit, dude. Can I open this? Of course it's locked. I can sprint. Light? Let there be light. Okay. More light? Oh? What's that? Nothing. Cigar. Or no, that's a pipe. Is this it? Is there nothing else? Is there anything I can grab in there? I guess not. We just move forward. Anything in these, though? Okay, just making sure. How many... <sighs> what is that? Is that a phone ringing? That's gotta be a phone. No? It is a phone. Hey. Shit, what is that? What? Can I pick it up? No, it's gone off the floor. Funny, dude. Is this? I can't even touch it. I can't. Okay, we just gotta go. What? What is it this time? Oh my god! Maybe I go backwards this time. Now I can go pick it up. Yes, 
Where's the phone? Is that it? Is it there? Hello? Ah! What fire? Oh shit. Oh god. Is she which hospital? I'm on my way. What? Wait. Still in the game, where is it? Where? What the? Where the hell am I? I can't see anything. I can just see the wall. Holy shit. Shattered thoughts. Oh, the light. Oh, shit. Come on, please. Flapping horror, be quiet. Constantly flapping, eating other rats. A bat? No, what? A flying rat? Oh, nah, bro. If rats start flying, that's the end. It's over. I'm never going outside again. Holy shit. Uh, fuck. What was that? Oh. Uh. Ah! Uh. Uh. Fuck. What happened? Fuck this thing again, dude. Oh, I guess I have no choice. What did we do to our wife? In any case, as your lawyer, I advise you to refrain from any imprudent actions. In other words, don't do anything stupid. You still have a high chance of winning this case. Believe it or not, I've gotten clients out of deeper shit than this. Just don't make it any worse. Lay low for a while and let me appeal the court order. The social worker definitely has it in for you. We can use that to our advantage. Betray you as a victim of the system. A husband in mourning. A momentary lapse of reason. An overzealous bureaucrat. Trust me, this is our best option. Considering what you've been through lately, I'd say we have a good 50-50 chance of a good outcome. But not if you keep trying to convince everyone that you've gone completely insane. No more outbursts, no more rambling, better yet, no public appearances whatsoever. You can still get, get your daughter- <gasps> He did kill his wife! He did! He did! He talked about it earlier with, he said, I couldn't use a bread knife. What, it cannot be undone. 
abandon hope while you can. All the drinking. He did. He talked about it earlier with his, with the knife. He said, I couldn't just use a bread knife. I had to use a sharp one, a razor. And so I did. He was talking about his wife. What's through here? Nothing. Huh. Holy shit. God, these freaking rats, dude. I don't want to waste water. Anything. Oh. Can I open this door? Oh. Oh. Silent floaters. They clog the train. For in the water. No bass for me. What the heck? Is there a light to turn on? Oh my god. Holy shit. That place again. Please, game. <laughs> Why? Oh. <laughs> Wait, I thought I'd been here. No? Oh. Wait, this room again? But four doors? Okay. Okay, so... What? No. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Huh. Oh, fuck. Ah. Uh, what happened? I have to know. all burning away. <gasps> Wait. Is this the back of the galactic? Maybe this is the back of the galactic. <gasps> they said that the fire occurred in the back. Maybe that's what happened. They said the fire the fire started in the back. Some something wrong with the wiring of the place. I'm only assuming this is the back because of the cloth that's over everything and everything burning away. See? Everything's burning away. What the heck? Oh, 
I can push things around? Oh. Oh. Oh shit. What the? Fur. Furry leech is afraid to look up. Oh my god! What? Just move it all. Oh my god! What? I needed to remove the flesh from the bone. No! At first I was lost as to how. But then I sawed it off with a handsaw. Boiled it. Then put the bone in a mortar. I had to get one, obviously. This was not something I'd done before. Finally, I mixed the dust with some white paint. It made for a lovely undercoat. What the fuck? What the fuck is wrong with us? What? Nah, bro, something's wrong with this guy. I don't know what the problem is. We knew that from the beginning. But... Oh, shit. What if you fail? Still nothing in this. This is still the same room. Now we've got two. The bottle and... Mm. What is it gonna be now? Oh my god. Oh, okay. Ignore her. Ignore her? Is it like keep walking? But... Shh. There's just nothing in here. What the fuck? Oh my god. What? What happened? Did he start the fire? We know that he killed his wife for sure, but what? Is that our? F Whoa. Drunk. Delirious. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Holy shit. Oh, my God. What? What the heck, dude? Did, did the daughter draw that? Hey, what 
is that? Wait. What day is it? It's Sunday? You mean I... Oh, well, why didn't you come and get me? God damn it! You know how I get when I'm caught up in my work! Oh, he missed his daughter's birthday. I'm guessing. He's mad at his wife for not getting him. What the hell? This doesn't even lead to a door. Anything in here? Oh! This is- Oh, this is our wife! He has nothing left of her. Marriage. Kids in marriage. Marriage guide. Expect the unexpected. The everyday magic of parenthood. The new book by Molly Pierce is a must-read for parents who are expecting their first child and want to create a happy, healthy environment for their baby. Order now and receive a free set of motivational tapes. Strong enough, volume one through one and two. Huh. Oh shit, dude. Oh what the fuck? What? Is that? <laughs> Sweet Jesus. Jesus! Did you just buy half of the department store? Honey, you don't even know yet if it's gonna be a boy or a girl. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. Wait. <sighs> These memories, dude. I had to move most of the dolls out of her room. It was getting ridiculous. You can't just throw gifts at her whenever you feel guilty. For whatever it is you feel guilty for. She needs a father, not another useless distraction. Wait, did he kill them both? Oh my god! What was that? Oh my god. Oh my goodness. What even happened? can't. Where do I go? Not here. Oh? Oh, it was another door. It was so dark I couldn't see it. Oh, ch Another piece. You beat me again. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder why I even bother. <laughs> Good thing we didn't bet on it. 
What? What's so funny? Yeah, this guy sounds like he wasn't good from the start. He definitely got worse, but... It's just board games. Near the Blueberry Rush by Emerald Creek. Huh. Anything? No. Are you here? Are you near me? Can you hear me? Wait. Can you hear me? You know, I'm gonna just leave that one alone for now. Mmm. <laughs> what? Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. This game is freaking... Nothing. Is it up here? Anything. So not an item to pick up. Oh my god! You just did this to be a prick? Literally? You create a rule where every time you hear voices, there's an item that you're supposed to pick up. But this time you just did it to fuck with me. You just did it to fuck with me, for no reason. For no other reason besides that. What did you gain from this? Satisfaction, I guess, or whatever, dude. I'm fighting the Bluebird team, personally. This asshole already needs to stop. nothing in this room. What will we find out by the end of this? Huh. Oh my gosh, dude. Wait, no? Okay. Wait, is this- this is the same room. I'm just I I feel like this game is it, it is it's not even too crazy with the jump scares. It's just a constant level of like dread and fear that's over you. You never know when something's going to happen, but nothing is good. There's there's never any levity. This game literally never lets you breathe. There's just less tension and then there's more tension.
dude. Oh my god. Holy sh Oh my god. Please cut me some slack, bro. Oh my god. What? Okay. Okay. Anything here for me? Nothing. That red vase. Wasn't there a door there? Oh, sh Hey. Um. I was, um, uh, oh, okay, um, okay. D uh, uh, what the fuck, dude? I, d I just, uh. oh my god, dude, this game is, I'm, I'm not, I'm just, I'm not, I can't, I can't, I just, There's, they're not even jump scares. It's just, I, I just, I feel like my, my blood pressure is just constantly up. It's just constantly elevated. I'm just constantly on edge. Like, like there's no jump scares. Like, like. I feel like this is, this is, this is the horror game that I've screamed the least on. I mean that I've, that I've done battle cries the least on because there's just not jump scares. It's just, it's just fear. Oh, okay. Oh my god. Oh, oh, okay. What if I just ignore the child? Oh! What the fuck? What about this way? Oh no, I'm back where I started. Well, shit. Oh. This way. Nah. What's this? Why are you guys laughing at the baby? This was the one that was in her room. I- look, I'm not scared. The thing is, is that I just... Like, you just- you, you know, I, it's, it's about respecting everything that's around me, okay? There's no fear here. What the fuck? What do I do? What? Holy shit. Wait, what? 
We're actually waking up now? What? What? This one? Where is it? Oh, is this? What is this crap? Oh, 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 I'm sorry, princess. No, 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 don't cry. We'll get you a new one. Or, or better yet, daddy's gonna buy you another dolly. Uh, so your other dollies can have a new friend. Huh. A nutcracker. Oh, shit. Somebody's got like, somebody's taking a really mean shit. My bad, bro. Honestly, the more rooms I go into this place, they really need to re renovate this shit, honestly. This house really needs to re-renovate. They need to fix this shit. There's way too much going on. Like, you guys thought this was a supernatural game? Yeah, definitely. Fighting demons on the toilet. That, that's, the, that's the best way to play it. Holy shit. Let's fix ourselves, okay? And honestly, the more I think about it, the more, like, old rich people, they, they, they deserve to have their houses haunted. Like, if you think about it, like, people from all the way back then, why are you buying dolls that looked like that? Why did you have trophies of, like, deer on your wall? You deserved that shit. What the fuck? Nah, bro. They were literally asking for it. They were literally asking for it. Swear to God. I uh, and uh, that t what the fuck does this say? Oh, it doesn't say anything. The only legible word here is beer. What the wait, a basketball? What time period is this game taking place in? Also, this lamp is way too, like, 2000s. There's no way. There's no way. This is... Whose room is this? Is this our daughter's room? How could she have all this shit? Is she from the future? Hello? Hello? Oh, it's our dog. Oh, cutie pie. Okay. Honestly, either this was owned by- Oh, oh? Fluffy fingers mocking me, lying still between toys. No toys allowed. Interesting. I feel like there was supposed to be something in this room, though. Oh, wait. Can I open these up? Oh. Yup. There certainly was. Anything in here? Letter? No. Damn. Oh. Oh no, I didn't miss anything. Okay. Whoa. What the? Wait. What did I just find? Scissors? What the? Huh? 
Am I looking for a blade now? Oh. Am I looking for the blade part of the scissors, the sharp part? No, that, that's scissors, right? I think that's scissors. Maybe. Nothing. That's that. No, I need the bot. Son of the bottom drawer. Hmm. What? Uh. Okay. Maybe there's another place that I don't know about. It's under the bed. Is there a blade in the bed? No, why would there be a blade in the bed? That would be dangerous. Okay. I can't go this way. That portrait of our dog, or that painting of our dog. There's this thing. This is like the calmest the game has ever been. High key. Like, honestly, I'm chilling right now. Nothing. Okay. Now I'm just confused. What do we even need scissors for anyways? What are we doing? Oh. Oh. Oh, it's not scissors. Are we going to see ourselves? Oh, no, we're not. Oh. Oh, shit is moving. Shit. It's Toy Story. But like, kinda spooky. fade above you, the room goes dark. Oh, it's getting closer. Mama used to come to tuck you in. Now she's nowhere to be seen. Oh, okay. We're back in Toy Story. All right, then. What the fuck? Bro, I, that door was just open. Oh. No. That's... What the heck was that? Maybe in here? Nothing? Wait. Where's the key? Did I pull it out? Oh. This was a special brush. Like a horsehair brush, but different. At that point, I hesitated. Will this really work? Fuck it. I was already halfway through, and besides, it's not like I can just put it all back and forget the whole thing. What? Oh. Oh, fuck, dude, what happened to our dog? Damn it! We were just fine! What? That thing not work? 
Yeah, no, that looks like hair more than like a horse brush or whatever a horse brush is. What was that? Pandas. There's that vase again. Somebody broke it earlier, though. I don't know how it's still intact. <sighs> no. What? No way, dude. Is it open? It was... Holy sh... Oh my god. Holy fuck, dude. Alright, we're going. See, I knew they were his. I knew they were his. They had to be his. What did he need baby dolls for? Why do you have so many? Or is this supposed to represent his daughter? Gone. Oh, we've got the lamp in our thing now. Okay. Uh... All right, I think it's gonna. I think it's a woman. I think the painting is a woman. Oh, it's a person. Oh, look at that. We're making something out. We're getting close. We're getting fucking close, dude. He's just struggling a little bit. He's got the spirit. He's a little confused, but he got the spirit. All right, let's go. On to the next one. Yeah, that's got to be like a portrait. Oh, we're going in circles again. Okay, painting. Book. Is that a walkie-talkie? No. That's locked. All these locked doors, bro. Can I open that? I can't, I guess. Why can't I open it? Okay, whatever. Box. That is locked. Everything, everything is locked. What is this shit? Nothing. Okay. All right, then. <sighs> what the? Why is it so dark? Is that a goat? Isn't the, Doesn't a goat usually have some reference to Satan, like the goat's head? Can't open that door. Can't open that door. Let's turn the lights back on. Delirious, easy to forget, drunk. Oh shit. Time. Uh um. Ah. Huh? Oh. Wait. Can I go any of the ways? Are these all the same room? They are. Okay. Nice. Let's just open them all up. Why not? The heck? Bro? Alright. Restless memories. Restless memories sounds like a really good movie. Hmm. Okay. I guess we just go to the door. Oh, it's that same bus from before. I'm guessing that's our wife. It's this painting. Not gonna lie to you, this looks like a really, really rough massage that this guy is getting. That's probably the kind of massage I need, considering how tight my neck is, like Jesus, dude. People tell me that all the time. You have so many knots. Like, well, I'm sorry, okay? Never been to the fucking spa. Why don't you give me one? Working for Ash is stressful, okay? Well, not really. It's actually super easy because I'm super fucking fantastic. But, like, man, oh, man. I just don't... I need to stretch more, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. Oh, this is a beheading painting? Honestly, that still sounds like a nice massage. Not gonna lie to you. Move. Move. Nothing here. 
No. <laughs> Could you imagine? Like, we're just gonna stretch this out for you. <laughs> Grinding into your neck. June 17th. He's on about the damn rats again. I don't think I've seen- I don't think I've even seen one. But that doesn't stop him from laying out traps all over the place. He claims he can hear them in the walls and that there must be hundreds of them. God, I fucking hope it's true. I hope they crawl out at night and eat you in your sleep. You cruel, self-obsessed, pathetic drunk. Oh, snap. We're slowly getting found out, guys. We are a terrible person. Hey, yo, who's more terrible? This guy for doing what he did? Or me for making a reservation? And then calling in to reschedule the reservation? And then canceling the reservation? Because if you cancel within 24 hours, you have to pay a fee. That's too easy of a workaround in, in too many policies. Make up your mind. The guy? The guy's worse? Okay, I thought so too. I just wanted to make sure, you know? I needed your opinions. Your opinions. I just, I just was curious what you guys thought. Oh, shit. Oh, it's that area right there. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh my god. Did that thing just kill me? Jump scares are so far and few in between, dude. These floorboards are so rickety. Somebody needs to clean up that mess. Okay, so the rats are definitely real. Say what you will about me and my delusions, but uh, you can clearly see the rats. Clearly see them. Very clearly. What's in here? Stuff? Anything out the window? Nothing? Okay. I don't know. Every time we see the rats, they just go away. Never to be hurt again. Oh, okay. That's nothing. Is there a key? Oh, hey, look at that. Hmm. Oh. More rats. Oh, you know, this makes me want to play Dishonored. Oh, I want to play Dishonored. Oh, shit, dude. This place really needs to be re renovated. My God. Uh, eh. Oh my gosh. Okay. I mean, all right then. Oh, here. Oh, a latch. Okay. These rats are fucking up the whole place. Jeez. This house is really big, dude. I just thought about it. We've gone to like several different time periods now. This house spans multiple millennia. This house, this place is massive. Oh shit. Oh, a letter. Cat, dog, rat. Um, okay, which way did the which way did the dog go? Rat. Uh, eight? Or no, are we going based on colors? The dog is two? And the cat is four? Two, four. Two, four, eight? Oh, oh, I see. Oh, I see. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, we gotta remember this then. Do we have to remember this? Um, all right, we're gonna say the cat is three and four, three and four, three, four. The dog is two, no, yeah, two and five. So three, four, two, five. 
three four two five. Remember that. Don't forget that. Three four two five six. Three four two five six eight. Three four two five six eight seven. Three four two five six eight seven. Unless the rat is bait. Three four two five six eight seven. Is there a combination where I have to put this in? Three four two five six eight seven. All right. Oh. Three. Four. What the? What? Huh? Three, four. Why does it keep doing that? Stop. Three, four. Huh? What? Three, four, two, five, six, eight, seven. Okay, it's not that. Okay. Hmm. Oh no, there's a third number. Oh, there's there's three numbers for each? Huh. Huh. Okay, so what is that? Cat is what? Three, four, and three, four, and one. Three, four, one. Three, four, one. Eight? I'm so confused. Okay. God, they're making me do fucking math, dude. This is this is the this is the actual horror part of this game. That's definitely 3. It's 4. Then 1. So 8. And the dog is Two, five, nine? Huh? Wait, what? Two, five, nine. Cat is three, four, one. Rat is... Rat is six, eight, seven. Six, eight, seven. Three, four, one, two, five, nine, six, eight, seven. Okay, it was six, eight, seven. What? It's still locked? Oh, it's a latch. La la, la 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 la. Oh. Oh no. Oh. I was thinking of La La Latch. Isn't that Sam Smith? It's a good song. Or no, it's just Latch. Oh, another panda. July 19th. Judging by the silence that has now fallen over the house, I can safely assume that he has finally passed out. Undoubtedly surrounded by empty bottles and tattered pieces of canvas that have become his preferred bedfellows. Every time it happens, I pray it will be the last. I pray fervently, passionately. 
Our Lord in heaven, let him crack his head open and the rot spew out. Let him cut his wrist on the glass and the red bile flow. Let him choke on his own vomit so that we all may find peace. For if you don't one day, I will find the courage to walk down the steps and end him myself. You of all should know, it's not the lack of will that stays my hand. Amen. Wait, what? Wait. Wait, so our... What? Wait, 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 wait. So our wife was planning to kill us? Or at least thinking about it? Like, really strongly thinking about it? Oh, the, th the plot thickens. So our... So may perhaps our wife wasn't a pure victim? I mean, this guy definitely did some awful shit, seems like. But, like, to say that he deserved death is... I don't know. I, I can't. I. I don't. I, I'm. I'm not. I'm not an arbiter. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe he has a condition that makes him assume the worst about people. Maybe he just believed that his wife was was plotting to kill him, and that was why he killed her. If he did kill her, I'm not sure anymore. This room got messed up. Hmm. Uh. Oh, finally a better painting at the end of the room instead of that baby. Instead of baby Chewbacca. The fuck was that, dude? Hey, sorry I haven't written in a while. I've been swarmed with work. I gotta tell you, your last letter was troubling to say the least i just can't believe she would set fire to your old paintings oh shit oh i just can't believe she would do that the lady in black especially that was your tribute to her wasn't it i don't know how to tell you except to get her some professional help pronto you could probably talk to someone as well with all that's happened i'm sure it would do you some good i probably don't need to tell you that the buyer was sorely disappointed with the news the new pieces just aren't selling as well as the classics. Anyway, I'll keep looking. You just hang in there and focus on your work. I know you still have it in, in you. I believe you. Your friend and agent, Thomas Cadwell. What? Wait. So, we have, we have three possibilities here. They're both unwell, or we're the unwell ones, and we're assuming that this is the case. That, or the wife was the unwell one. I've seen plot twists like that in movies before, where the main character, due, due to like a condition, believed that they were, or like they were convinced. It's like the power of suggestion. They were convinced that they were the wrongdoer, or they were acting in a way that, that would make it seem like they were the one that did wrong, but they weren't. They were just so heavily influenced by the person that they loved in their life that told them that they were wrong and that they were evil and that they were, you know, all these different things. They ended up just becoming this way, or at least heavily believing that they were this way. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I just need to open this. Fucking mutt won't shut up. Hey, I can do that too. <laughs> See? But can you paint? No? Well, that's all right. Neither can I, apparently. Holy shit, my dude just barked. That's crazy. Barking goes all the way back to this far back in time. People used to bark so long ago. Oh my god. I never would have guessed. Looks like it's not just me. Insane. The hell was that? What's well, going further in? Oh my god. God, okay. Oh, that's an eye. Oh. Is it? Oh, shit. Um. Holy shit. Oh my god.
we're getting up once again. What's even still happening? We've already opened this. Yeah. Okay. Another rat. Anything in here? Just a painting. Or just a canvas, rather. The back of a canvas. Doesn't look like we can interact with it much. I don't see anything at the very... Oh! Canvas crawlers. Massive pulsating fur. Poison to paint. Fire. Final solution. Hmm. Why did she set fire to his... <gasps> Wait! Hmm. Maybe he was the one that set fire to his paintings and he blamed his wife. Or he did it and, and convinced himself. Oh my God! <laughs> Maybe he convinced himself that she did it. <sighs> hey there, princess. What? Oh, <laughs> this is daddy's medicine. Whenever daddy's hurting, this helps the hurt go away. No, don't touch that. Oh, God. I'm so. Wait. I'm sorry. I I'm sorry. What did he do? Oh, shit. Oh, we got that. That's like a tourney thingy. That is moving. The burns. Oh my god! Did it say don't look behind you? Well, my fucking bad, okay? Oh shit. Oh, do I have to keep pulling it? Oh. He doesn't sound too happy. Huh. Um. Oh. Oh. This game in VR sounds like it would be fun, honestly. Okay, nothing. Anything. Where could it be? Anything. Oh. I will make you right. Who's who's the ill one? Maybe 
Maybe his painting is what was making him like depressed and him making him drink all the time. And he became more and more unwell as time progressed. Oh shit. Oh shit. Maybe that's why. So he's like, you took you took my gift away from me. So clearly she burned his paintings because maybe she thought that if she ruined everything and tore and like destroyed his past, then maybe he'd forget about painting and move on, get a normal job so that they can live a normal life and he could stop drinking and being stressed out about everything. That honestly sounds like a reasonable line of uh of continuity. I'd believe that if somebody told me that that's what happened. Cause that's, that's totally understandable. I'm not gonna lie, that's kind of a tight beat. Oh sh! Uh, oh my god! Okay. Oh my god! <sighs> I really love when you play horror games. Fight. Fighting, my boy. Keep fighting. I'm doing my best. This, this, these games are trying to take me out. This one's really interesting, though. I feel like this one isn't particularly, like... I don't know. It's interesting. I find that rather it being, like, a horror or, like, just overtly scary game... I feel like it's more of a really good story being told. Like, like a really scary, but also, like, really just awful story being told through the lens of horror. It's a very interesting way to play a game. Hickory dickory dock. The mouse ran up the cock. The cock struck one. The horde ran down. Hickory dickory dock. <laughs> oh. Okay, yeah, he's definitely the not the not well one in this relationship. Yeah. Yeah, psychological horror, I think, is a great way to put it. It's a phenomenal way. It's a, it's a phenomenal and very interesting way to tell to tell a story. Because I find that I have this, like, sense of dread because of, like, the story and what's actually happening. Because I don't know what the outcome is and I don't know all the details just yet, but I know that it's not a good outcome. And that makes me feel bad, you know? And when I do get jump scared, it's like, that's it. It's just jump scares. 
It's nothing like super crazy. It's not like scary like, you know, when you can fend for yourself. Because you can't really die from what I've understood in this game. Like, it, it's clear that you can mess up because there's collectibles and things that you can miss and not miss. But it's not like scary. Like, when I think of scary, I think of like, like playing Outlast. That was kind of scary. Because there was something there in front of me and it was a real threat. And I had to run away. But now it's like, I'm kind of just experiencing it. Experiencing it. It feels kind of like a movie. You know... Even though you are my rival and the source of all my sorrows, you're also the only one I can still talk to. The only one who will listen. I'm not sure if it's funny or merely pathetic. <laughs> Probably both. Huh. Whose is this? Was he... Was he cheating on his wife? Was he macking on another girl? What's in here? What is that? What the hell is that? Anything in here? Anything? Okay. It's just a room, I guess. I don't know. Oh, this door's finally open. Hmm. See... But the vision of his wife looking like that makes me think maybe she was the one that was unwell. Maybe she like never recovered from the fire or something. Maybe they maybe they both are just unwell. Oh, we're back at the office with that creepy baby Chewbacca drawing. Hmm. Oh. Wait, where's the phone? What are you looking at? I hear it in here. Oh. Oh. Oh, I see. Talk to me. Why won't you talk to me? Three, six, three. I don't... How do I dial this? Did I even do it right? Fuck, dude. What did I call? Like an insurance company or something? Why am I on hold for so long? Motherfucker, dude. Oh, shit. Oh. Wait, where's the phone? Why can I still hear it? There's still something. Perhaps. Can I leave? No, I can't. I hear the phone, like, behind here. Nothing. What's shaking? Is there nothing here? Huh. 
Can I not open that? Some paintings defy simple words, let alone critique. A basic knowledge of the subject is an absolute must if one is to even try taming them. Babyface is one such painting. This art anomaly draws tens of thousands of mediocrity enthusiasts and Sunday abstraction aficionados. In reality, it looks like a result of a week-long art marathon of a not very well-adjusted painter locked in a dark basement. Leaving aside the horrible execution, the painting excels in a hideous... Oh. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, snap. Wilson. Oh. Wilson. Thank you for the raid. Welcome, you QTs. Guys, this game, unironically, I, ha I, 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 unironically, I haven't even screened that much. I'm actually a warrior. I hope Zomboid went well, gamer. Oh, this place is getting more beat up by the second. I'm just trying to find out where this phone is. Okay, I guess we're not going to find it. We were looking for a phone because it's ringing right now, but it's not anywhere to be found. Wilson, is this you picking up? I'd answer if it was you, but I can't reach it. I guess not. Is it really just not here? Okay, whatever, I give up. I won't lie, though, playing this game, I really want to know what Wilson thinks of it. <laughs> oh, more light. Huh. Okay. I guess the phone's just gone. It's okay. We're going to leave. Because I'm going to lose my mind if I keep hearing that ringing. Oh, is it? I don't even... Oh, it's not. It reset. Weird. Okay. We can fix it. Okay. I mean, to be fair, I don't think my heart rate has actually moved all that much. I'm actually kind of a god. There you go. Okay. All right, it should be working now. Stop the cap. Hey, 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 you know what? Why don't you just look at it, okay? And this time, and this time, Wilson is here. He can vouch for me. You can vouch for me. Wilson's totally gonna vouch for me. He's gonna tell everybody that my heart rate didn't move during this game. He's gonna be like, "Oh my gosh, Benta was so like impressive the entire time. Benta was so like impressive the entire time." Don't X to doubt him, because he's so great at horror games. Oh. Oh, so it stopped ringing? Oh, so I wasn't even supposed to look for it. I swear, dude. I swear. You gotta believe me. Oh, we're up top now. Oh, you're right. He's got a meeting. Oh, okay. He's got a collab with Staff Son. Oh, sh- <laughs> I didn't even get to look where I was falling, dude. Well, UQTs, if you're familiar with this game at all, this story is wild from start to finish. Okay, so... Where... Where is it going on? Okay. Oh. Back with this shit. Where? We're back in this room. I don't get it. Let's turn on all the lights again. Wait, did I mess up? Maybe I wasn't supposed to fall. Oh. 
wait, did I actually screw up? Maybe I actually screwed up. Yeah, I don't think I was supposed to fall, guys. I think I reloaded. It's the same thing. Wait. No, we're back in our office. He doesn't have a 363. Is it... Am I supposed to... Open. Open sesame. Wait. Yeah. This is the same place. Isn't it? Oh. Oh, so you can't die. <laughs> okay, never mind. Oh? Oh, bro. Wait, no. Wait, can you fall off? You can fall. I was doing it for science, okay? I was doing it for science. I was doing it for science. I was doing it for science. I did the first one for science too. I was just trying to see if you could fall again. All right. You know what? Believe what you want, okay? Believe what you want. You can tell by the fact that my heart rate didn't move. That's how you know. That's how you know that I was doing it for science. I wasn't shocked by it even a little bit. I knew that it would happen because I was testing it. God dang, bro. Where is it? Oh, this way. You promise. Wait. Well, that's not good. Three. Wait, is that three? Wait, is that a backwards three? Three, five, eight? Am I reading that correctly? I guess that's a backwards three. Three, five, eight. Three, five, eight. Wait, did I do it right? Okay. I mean, this game has a tendency to do shit backwards. Oh! 853, I see! I was about to make fun of the devs. Nice. There's another phone. Oh, wait, I'm trapped. Oh. Wait, what? Wait. What? Were we the one that pushed it? Huh? Resolves nothing. It never has. It never will. Well, that's not good. Oh. Wait, where do I go?
What? Wait. Is this is this the painting telling me to jump off? Am I supposed to jump off? Then I'm supposed to jump off. Oh. That was supposed to be funny. Three, five, four. Okay. <laughs> Fuck, bro. What? It's a doll, okay? You make it seem like I was laughing at a real baby. Oh my g Holy heck, dude. Oh! What am I supposed to do now? Am I supposed to grab onto the chain? No. Probably not. Oh my g Oh, there's no more- Oh! Oh my god, dude. Bro. Oh, what happened to Babyface? Oh. You deserve this. All of it. All of it. Uh, damn, okay. That's kind of mean. What do I deserve, though? What happened? I needed something to add the, how should I put it, final touches. <gasps> a finger. I needed a finger. Oh, shit. Chopped it off. Easier than sawing a leg. Washed it. Dried it in an oven. Fell asleep. Almost burned it. Will I manage to pull this off? Oh my god. No, he he is he is the wrongdoer. He did kill his wife. The portrait that we're painting is of our wife and it's using our wife. Oh my god, we're painting our wife with our wife. That's why the brush is using hair. That's our wife's hair. Oh my god. Trick. Trail and air. Trial and error. Shit. That's what's happening. He killed his wife. Yeah, look at it. Look at the painting. Look at that. That's why it looks like that. That's real, like, you know. That's real. That's real guts. That's real, like, insides. And you want to know how I know that it's real insides? Because there's no way this motherfucker knew what insides look like enough to paint them this vividly there's no way this is clearly an actual this is clearly an actual thing he's using his wife as a reference to paint this he's using his wife as a reference to paint this he did this he did this to her he did it there's no other way nah We've got one fucking more, dude. Let's fucking ball. Where are we going? Alright, this just led me out into the same hallway. Sick. Oh no, it didn't. Never mind. Back in our kitchen area. We outside now? Oh, it, yeah, we're back in our house. Back in our kitchen. Oh. 
There once was a man full of passion, but then his wife went out of fashion. Her face was a mess. He couldn't care less. She hated the man with passion. Okay, so I I didn't want to I didn't want to assume that this was the case, but what I'm thinking is that after the fire, he may or, the after the fire he may or may not have caused in the galactic. He stopped being attracted to his wife. He stopped he stopped being in love with her. This is this is kind of what I thought, but I didn't want to think that that was the case because I was like it couldn't be that simple, but maybe it is. He stopped he stopped loving her because he wasn't attracted to her anymore after what happened. He started drinking after after that after so so it was like basically all he had was his wife. But then he lost at least what he thought of her, which is so unfortunately sad, like my god. She's still in there, bro. Sure, she may have had to have skin grafts and she may have some burns, but that's still your wife. And then his art started to fail, so then he led to drinking. God, that's so sad. Oh. Oh. Oh! Okay. Rats? Oh, jeez, that's loud. Oh, shit. Um... Oh, God. Oh, shit. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm just gonna... Okay, all right, we're good. Just gonna go back. Is she still coming through? The door, like, is she still coming? You mind explaining this to me? I know what it is. Care to tell me how it got in my workshop? Stop lying! We both know it couldn't have gotten there on its own. Oh, it's locked. Okay. So, here's what I'm thinking. She got burned. All he, he, did, he stopped caring about her. All he had left was his art. His art started failing. He, he resorted to drinking. So she thought, maybe if I burn his artwork, maybe, maybe she sabotaged it. Maybe she started sabotaging it. She started burning his artwork, setting it up so that... But no, there's also that letter that says that she, doesn't, she didn't know about the rats at all. So maybe the rats were a figment of his imagination. I'm not sure anymore. Oh? This place again. She just wanted she just wanted him to talk to her. What the fuck? I must have like just missed that or something. Huh. Was that? I'm gonna run away. I'm running away. I'm going down the stairs. The latch. Holy shit. What is this place? Wait, no. I turn this. Yeah. 
What the fuck? There's something on here? Can I fall down? Oh. Yeah, I guess that answers that question. Where did I fall into? What the? What? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Is, is that her? Can she hear us? This is all fixable, right? No, you don't understand. Her face, her hands, I, she will be devastated. Oh shit, dude. Oh, I see. I see now. Wow. Can you ever paint anymore? Mother fucker. Dude, don't you know that you don't fuck with these? You don't mess with Luigi boards, okay? These things are never good. I don't know what to do. What am I supposed to do? I don't know. What, what, I don't know what to do. I don't know how to use one of these. Four? I have absolutely no idea what to do. What? Flirt with the ghosts? Oh, okay. Do... Um, you... Oh, no, 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 never mind. Are... You... Sing... Gull... Oh, shit, wait. Oh, wait, I didn't think... Oh, 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 no. Okay, um... Wait, what? What would this be? What would this be? Um... You... Trying to... Oh fuck, that doesn't fit. Mm. Um R U single 
Oh, wait. Okay. Um a a Thank you for the gifted gifted pog. I don't know what to do. What am I supposed to put into the Luigi board? Wait, how many of these? Three, six, nine, mm, no. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what the answer is. Wait. Something that's interesting, though, is that I remember something distinctly. This doesn't. Neither does the zero. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I can't go back. Okay, I guess I just can't do it. Oh, wait. Oh, it's too late. Damn it. I could have put in Jenny's number. 8675309. That sucks, dude. Oh, okay. God, I am such an idiot. To think that someone like me could ever compete with you oh. in all your sublime beauty, everlasting, immortal. Oh! That's why. That's why she burned the paintings. He, 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 he threw himself into his art because the most beautiful thing in the world to him was his wife. But once her beauty went away, her physical beauty went away, he he delved himself into his art. So she burned the paintings, even the lady in black or whatever the name of the painting was, despite it being a dedication to her, because she hated the painting. The painting was supposed to be a tribute to her to, to the flawless beauty that he had fallen in love with. But he didn't think that it that it wouldn't be everlasting. I guess the thought never occurred to him. Did he not think he would grow old with his wife? Sure, it happened a bit sooner than expected, but Jesus, dude. There's no reason to completely ignore her and not talk to her anymore. That's so sad. Oh. October 2nd. My love, I wish I could do what all mothers do and tell you that true monsters aren't real. But it wouldn't be true. Life can create things of exquisite beauty, but it can also twist them into hideous things. Selfish, violent, grotesque, monstrous. It hurts me to say that your father has turned into one such monster. And I am afraid the disease that afflicted his mind has taken hold of me as well. <gasps> it sickens me to think that we've put you through. It sickens me to think of what we've put you through. There is no excuse. I only ask of you, though. I know I do not have the right to do so. To try and forgive us. I despise what your father has become. But I love and pity him all the same. I only hope you can find it in your heart to feel the same about him, about me. I wish I could see you blossom to a strong, beautiful woman. I wish I could be there for you, but I can't. This is the only way. Goodbye. 
So they they tried to kill each other? Oh shit. That's why she wanted to kill him. Because she knew that he was unwell and there was nothing she could do about it because she was in love with him. God, that's so tragic. Crazy. Vermin growth. Vermin. Wait, no. Vermin growth, cancer of the house, foul stench. Oh, God, the sounds. <gasps> the knife. That was the knife at the beginning when we opened the door from the kitchen. The knife went into the into the door, remember? Perhaps she tried to use a knife to kill him. So Open this fucking door. I need to go. Open up. Hell is hell is Oh god. No. No, 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 no. What have you done? No. Wait, she killed herself? No. No way. Did she slit her wrist in the bathtub? No way. Is that why our main character isn't okay? So he didn't kill us? No. Maybe he found her dead and then used... Oh my god, what's happening? I must know. I must know. Oh. Oh. What? Oh. So I have to hold it all the way. All right. So maybe it it definitely wasn't him that that caused the fire then. The fire was an unfortunate accident. So perhaps he didn't kill his wife. Maybe she, maybe she killed herself, and then... Maybe she killed herself, and then he found her. But then he did something, like, completely crazy with her body. It seems like he cut her up with a knife. He took off her finger. And then he also used her hair for a brush. Hmm... I don't know. Yeah, there's also this there's also the, the 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 Luigi board. Maybe he tried to bring her back. Maybe that's why he's dealing with the supernatural. Not being all mentally there combined with the Luigi board. That's not a good it's not a good combo. Music. Finally, someone had to bear witness. I couldn't just look at my own work. Art and the artist needed an audience, a critical eye on things. I knew what I had to do. I gouged it, scooped it up like ice cream, felt like a butcher. A monster, but at least there was to come something beautiful from all this filth. Oh my god. So she... So he found her. He found her like that. He found her dead in the bathtub, potentially. And then he he gave one last portrait to his wife, or at least the memory of her. What? What?
Where are we? Oh, Sunny Zimbai. Thank you for the raid. Welcome. Welcome, Briscadettes. Oh, Sunny Senpai, or should I say, Sunny, my man. <laughs> I know the truth now. Oh! Pieces, I see. I've finally been educated. They finally educated me, I learned. I know the truth now. But yes, welcome, Briscadettes. Enjoy your stay. I hope you had a great stream, Zenny Senpai. What is... Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Okay. Uh... Just to catch you up to speed, I think we're about to, I think we're nearing the end of this game. We're trying to figure out the truth. We don't know, we don't have all the answers quite just yet, but we're doing our best. Yeah, I don't know what's happening anymore. It's all confusing. But yeah, we're definitely towards the end. If, you, if you're not familiar with this game... Huh. We seem to be someone that's not mentally well. And we're going through this broken house of distorted memories. Where it seems like we're trying to piece together exactly what happens between this man and his wife and the fate of their daughter. I'm scared. I don't know what's going to happen, though. Huh. Is this it? Just here? Wait, what? Where? Oh. What the? Please don't wait. Where? Where are you saying you relate to this guy? Please. He's just like me. What the? Why am I spinning? I'm. My hands are not on my keyboard right now. What? What? What in the... Uh, why? Why is it spinning? Stop! I'm so dizzy, dude. It's not even going that fast that I'm dizzy. Where am I going? Please. Please. Where? What? Oh my god. I'm so sorry if you... I can't do anything with it. It's just chilling. What was that? Nah, we're in the last part. I'm expecting you guys to not pull out any of the stops on this shit. Oh, I'm not spinning anymore. Pog. Okay. Where? Here. I have a jar. What do I do with the jar? God, it's so dark. I can't see anything. Anything. What? What are you? Is there... I have the jar with the eyeball in it right now. I think. I think that's all I have. This? 
Oh, another piece. Is there one more that I'm missing? Why am I still spinning? Please. I'm on a carousal. Please. I'm trying to fight against it. A carousal? Wait, is there something I'm supposed to pick up? A carousal, right? Like this. This thing right here. This is a carousal. I don't understand. Again? Oh. Are you telling me carousal is pronounced just like Bologna? This shit pisses me off, dude. I hate English. Oh, that's new. Oh, wait, what, what just fell? Oh. Oh. Sh shit. Where are we going now? This place keeps changing and they just keep making me spin. This game hates me for row for row. Maybe there's another piece around here. I'm finding the checker pieces, or whatever game this is. I think it's checkers. Is there... I can go over here. Is this a door? No, it's just a corner. <laughs> oh! Oh. We got all the pieces. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, this game makes me so wild. What the hell? What? What the hell? Ah, oh, shit, it's up there now! What is this? What is going on? What? Are you gonna do something? Nothing. I'm so... Oh! What do you stand to win? Hmm. I don't know. Oh, that doesn't look good. Is it not over here? Damn it, dude. What's over here? You're telling me this was just the distraction? <sighs> I'm just trying to find the next way. Oh, oh, there's a whole ass staircase. Okay. Oh, the bathroom. Oh, nice, another piece. Nothing, anything, broken, mirror. Put another piece on. Oh, nothing, okay. All right, we're going up the stairs. Oh, nice. Oh shit. What? What is... Oh 
my god, the knife! Oh, that's not a knife. I'm just looking at something wrong. That's definitely blood, though. It's gotta be blood, no? Oh, over here. In the kitchen. Oh, wait! We're back at our house! Oh my god, yeah. There's portraits in here. Oh. Oh, that's the drink. That's the thingy that we wanted to drink before. He said that he drank it. I think we've been in our house the entire time. We've just been traversing through memories. Oh my god, all the blood. Oh shit. This is this the image of him dragging his wife through? Where? I keep hearing sounds. Anything in here? No? Nothing. Nothing. <sighs> Nothing. Mmm. On the table? Oh! Okay. We're weighing the blood. How the hell do we even get this many pieces? This one has blood on it. This one doesn't. What's next? Oh, it's our office. Oh my god, and Babyface. Or I guess that's not Babyface anymore. Oh, do I go in the painting? No. Where's that being played from? Oh. Above? Oh. Um. Whoa. Whoa. Back in here. Holy shit. Oh my god. Alright. What does the final product look like? Yes. That's it. <laughs> it's beautiful. Perfect. Just like I always imagined. What? What is this? I, I don't understand. <laughs> no. Stop it. Please. What? So Bro, she was so beautiful. You didn't deserve her. I almost had it. You didn't deserve her. Oh my god. <laughs> Bro, are you serious?
the way the way it seemed like I the way it seemed like it was like she was unrecoverable. You didn't deserve such a beautiful woman, dude. You're a disappointment. Imagine somebody promising to spend the rest of their life with you in holy matrimony. Infidelity. In sickness and in health. In life and in death. Forever. And you have the nerve to let any kind of physical change change how you feel about them. Crazy, Dio. Just fucking insane. Wow. That's just crazy, dude. So he drew her with the burns and without- Bro! I don't even understand. You know what? Whatever, bro. I'm forever just gonna be mad at this guy. So he's been tearing his house apart. Trying to paint this vision of his wife. Or at least what he thought of her. What he thought was her most beautiful, quote-unquote. My dearest wife, I know that these past few months have been devastating. I know that I should have been more supportive, more caring, more selfless. I still can't believe some of the things I said to you. I guess I was never meant to be a great husband or father. I thought I could be a great artist, but that dream has ended as well. In its absence, I will do my best to treat you with all the love and compassion you deserve. You are the love of my life, my muse. You will never read this letter. I am so sorry. Did he write this after her death? Wow. This is so tragic. This is so tragic. He only realized his mistake after he did what couldn't be undone. Whoa! No way! Is this the credits? That's so sick! Is this how they did the credits of the game? Wow. That is so cool, dude. That is so sick. Wow. Okay, this is get this is too long. It's too long. That's cool though. Huh. Hmm. So yeah, where's their daughter? That's the real question in all this. Like what's going on with their daughter? Is she okay? Maybe she left. Maybe she's... I mean, maybe she's not in the household anymore. I mean, there's no way she's living here. My god. I think the DLC, from what I understand, the DLC focuses on... on from it, it focuses on the daughter's perspective. So, perhaps playing the DLC will give us a bit more... Uh, a bit more information. Jeez. Wow. I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. That one precious thing you ever truly desired. Finish it. So, this whole time, it was a letter to himself. 
hoping that he would finish the painting of his beloved wife. Wow, dude. Holy shit. Wow. I feel like I wanted to explore the house more. That's unfortunate. I didn't think this would end the game. I think that's the end. I think that's definitely the end. Wow. Huh. Interesting. Huh. Well... Pretty good game, if I do say so myself. Interesting. So yeah, it looks like it's a loop, because that's pretty much how we started the game. It looks like he's just constantly doing paintings over and over again of his wife. And every single time, he can never achieve what he wants, so the game just starts over. Loved your theorizing and how you pieced together the lore. You did fantastic. Fantastic! Atmosphere core really hits different. Yeah, this game was kind of phenomenal, I'm not gonna lie to you. I really appreciated their, their approach to storytelling. Thank you so much for the super. I'm I'm glad. I'm, gl I'm glad we, we could all enjoy uh, theorizing together. Wait, there's multiple endings? What? There's multiple end. Wait. How many endings are there? And are they easy to achieve? How many endings are there in Layers of Fear? There's three. I see. The game, the game has three different endings you can either stumble upon or aim for. Each of the endings depends upon the choices you make during the game, and as to whether or not these choices could be deemed selfish or selfless somewhat. Huh. Interesting. Wild. I found this ah, Siri! I don't know. This is it. This is the neutral ending. Okay. Sometimes the way I move my hand activates around my watch. That's how I. That's how I do my uh, my heart rate. Interesting. Okay, but here's the question: Do I have to do the game completely over again in order to get another ending? Like. Interesting. So it'd have to start completely over again? So like, oh, I see now. That's why they said achievement hunters and like true gamers will end up spending 10 hours on the game. Because apparently the game is roughly like three and a half hours long, something like, something like that. But if you want to get all the endings, then I guess get all the achievements, then you're going to be spending 10 hours because you have to do three separate playthroughs. Yeah, you're literally going to, have to do three separate playthroughs of the game. So if the game is like three and a half hours long, you're going to be spending at least 10 hours because you have to beat it over and over again in order to get all the endings. <laughs> Endurance stream? Endurance stream to get all the endings? Interesting. I don't know. This one felt... 
I don't know. What was the ending that I got? I don't even know. I don't even know what ending I got. I got the endless loop ending. Huh. Okay. Yeah, based on based on these descriptions, it looks like uh, I don't know. Interesting. I'm not really sure. Weird. I don't know. <laughs> it's three and a half hours, guys. That's three and a half wait, can I select no, I can select chapters, but that won't change anything. Yeah, even if I do chapters, it won't make a difference. I'll ha I literally have to do the entire game over again. And do the right thing. I don't know, guys. <laughs> I don't know about this one. I don't know about this one. I literally have to play the entire thing over again. I think I would die if I did that. Yeah. I don't know. The witness prepared us for this? What do you mean the witness prepared us for this? I'd have to like... God, I just realized this mini music is kind of gorgeous, not gonna lie. Hmm. I don't know. The witness endurance stream. I don't know, guys. I don't know. I don't know about that one. I don't think it's a good idea. I could, like, even if I went for one more ending, I would be up for, like, until 2 a.m. I mean, I could potentially do, like, other streams. I don't know. <laughs> Interesting. There's so many ways to approach this. Yeah, I I don't know. I don't I don't think I don't I don't think it'll be a good idea. Huh. Yeah, I think I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna not do that. I think I'm gonna not do that. Tomorrow is kind of gonna be a big day, so I should probably like set myself up. It was a crazy game. I don't like any type of horror, but this wasn't too bad with your storytelling and theories. I don't get scared when watching scary games with you because you're brave and cool. Wow. You guys hear that? I'm brave and cool. Yeah, I'm kind of I'm kind of brave. I'm kind of brave. You know, you know. I may I may use battle 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 cries to um, you know, fear my enemies a little bit too often, but you can't deny you can't deny my my willingness to go forward. Thank you guys for the for the yellow super. Thank you for the super almond Paki. Thank you so much. Thank you both. I appreciate it. And thank you for everything today. Um, I'd like to read I'd like to read uh some supers because I believe there are some that I missed. Uh so I want to go over those really quick. I know that there were some that I missed. Well, the cool thing about this game though is that we don't actually have to feel so bad. Because this game not only has a DLC. But there's also, ow, ow, why? There's also Layers of Fear 2019. Uh, okay, I'm saying Layers of Fear and Siri thinks I'm talking to her. Stop, stop. My God. Yeah, there's Layers of Fear 2. That's loud. This game looks pretty as hell. So we've got Layers of Fear 2. Ow, I'm so sorry about that. My god. And then there's also Layers of Fear, the most recent one. Yeah, that's the most recent one. This one looks gorgeous. 
Wait. Wait. Okay, I thought that this was a remake or something of the original. All stories must come to an end, even twisted and eerie ones. The canvas, the stage, the novel. This narrative-focused psychological horror experience is ready for its final brushstrokes. It's curtain call. It's final chapter. Are you ready to return to face your fears one last time? Wait, are all of them connected? Are all the games connected? Are layers of fear... Your game is connected. Well, that's gonna be sick. Okay, so yeah, there's actually two more games to play. That's cool. They're saying two is definitely a sequel. Okay, so I see. So if you've played one, they say you'll feel it, but it's not totally necessary to play one in order to play two. However, they do reward you for playing one if you did play two, with like references and stuff. So you'll you'll notice a lot of things if you played this if you if you play the first one. If you played the first one and then you play the second one. Interesting. What do you mean you can't see gifted memberships? Like, I mean, they work. What do you mean by you can't see them? I'm confused. Wait, do you need to be a member to gift? Interesting. I'm lost. I'm confused. Question mark. You don't. Oh. I don't know then. I, I DK. I was just a, dude, I, I, I have, dude, I have PTSD, man. I have fear. I genuinely just get thrown off. I was like, what do you mean you can't see them? Is there something wrong again? What are you fucking talking about? I was, I was genuinely just like, what? What this time? What, what do you have to tell me? Yes, I have layers of fear when it comes to using members. <laughs> Why would you say that? <laughs> You're trying to activate it. Oh my gosh, my gifted membership war flashbacks. You're trying to... <laughs> oh, to Vanta, the whole theory and talking in the game make, you, make me enjoy it. So thank you, and hopefully you have some rest. Yeah, I noticed this game uh, quickly. Uh, this game wasn't like the traditional kind. It's kind of like a story that you're supposed to experience. And thank you, Dizzy, for the super. Whoa, thank you for the gifted... Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Almondwaki, for the gifted, for all the gifted memberships. Thank you so much. You are way too kind. I, I'm like, I am, God. I'd love to watch more layers of you in the future. Also, your, narr your narration was perfect. Take care and have a good rest, Kushi. Thank you. Yeah, okay, so, next, next, and thank you for the super. Thank you so much. You should do a reading ASMR or something. I love your reading voice. <laughs> you know, I'll have to talk about that again at some point. I'll have to. I think I think that that's some that's something that that does need to be talked about. Wow! Thank you for the gifted gifted memberships, gifted pog. Thank you so much, and thank you, Yaya-san, for the super. Um, here I would like to go over these, but luckily, yeah, there, there's there's a whole last three other games. There's a whole last three other games, so. We've got a lot. We've got a lot of we've got a lot of these games to go through. But yeah, maybe I'll have to tell some stories uh, in the future. That sounds like it'll be fun. Sounds like it'll be really fun. I just I have like a specific kind of voice that I go in like, like I don't know. It just feels right, you know. Like I think, in, instead of just talking like in my normal voice like this, I just go like, layers of fear. Finish it. Wait, finish it. Wait, huh? What does that mean? Finish it? Huh? 
Auntie Vanta, your your war cries keep me awake at work. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, Waylon, for the super. And thank you for the gifted. What in the world? Wait, what does finish it mean? I can go back? Oh, shit. Oh, no, the game is starting over. Okay, never mind. <gasps> never, never mind. Never mind. Thank you so much for the gifted. Thank you, thank you so much. Um, and also, uh, here, actually, let's go back. We're, 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 we can, we can stop, I think. Because I, I believe we're actually going to stop now. Okay. We can jump back here. Ooh, I like it. I like it. But yeah, I wonder when we'll actually visit them because we have a few series now that we're that we we have. Because you know, Outlast also has a DLC, and it has a second game. And Layers of Fear has three games. We've started two separate horror series now. Welcome back, Rococo. Yeah, yeah, we do actually. We do. Yeah, so we've, we've got a couple series, you know, we've got a couple of things. There's a couple. You know what game I also am interested in? I haven't really gotten to play it. Amori. Wow, Dizzy, thank you for the gifted memberships. Um... Let me see. Y'all are actually losing your minds. I, I'm like, oh, Omori, O-M-O-R-I, O-M-O-R-I. It's a, uh, it's an RPG, so it's my kind of game. It's like uh, multiplayer. However, um, I don't exactly know how the story is, but I know that it explores really, really like rough topics, like really dark, darker topics. But it's really interesting, and it's like, it's a fantastic game from what I understand. So, I, I'd, I'd like to revisit it, because I did play it at one point, but something happened uh, that made it that made it so that I couldn't finish the game. So I ultimately opted not to, but now I think I'm in a much better place and I can I can play it. Oh yeah, there's also the Fears to Fathom series. That series is actually recommended to me by, uh, by Nita Senpai. So I, I, gotta, I, gotta, I gotta play that at some point. I have to, without a doubt. Fears to Fathom has to be touched. Like, there's, there's so many. I actually might have to get a list compiled so that I can know all the games. Because, like, gosh, I know that there's Amnesia. Amnesia has a bunch of games. I have Layers of Fear now. There's Outlast. There's Madison. There's... God, there's so, there's so many games. And then, so look, I've played... I've played, um, uh... Mortuary Assistant. But from what I've understood since the last time I played it, which is several months ago at this point, probably over a year ago now... When I played it, like, there's been an update since then? Has the game changed? I think they've added stuff, like jump scares, they've added endings, they've added a, they've added more stuff to it. Right? Didn't they add more stuff to it? I think more stuff has been added to it, so I kind of want to revisit it at, like, at some point. Uh... To, uh... You know. I think that they've added a lot of stuff, so I think I'm gonna wait a bit until until that you know until I'm, I'm gonna see if i can forget some stuff if you end up doing a reading game summer may i recommend a book the strange case of dr jekyll and mr high i know everyone has probably read it but it's an amazing book i haven't actually and thank you for the super guys on asmr you end up doing a reading asmr hmm i wonder i'm actually wondering exactly what kind of things i can read if i were to do something like that if you play amori just watch for the backstating it can get insanely bad on that game especially oh really huh I wonder why. Is there like particular things that you can do or choices that you can make that are like that are like really game changing? Thank you for letting me know, Mastin. Thank you for the super. I've never played the Evil Within. I gotta ask you guys. I gotta ask you guys. I'm gonna ask you guys in a community post. I think that's the that's the best way to go about it. Is to ask you guys in a community post and just compile a list.
Edith Finch. I've seen Evil Within. I don't know. I like horror games, so I'd like to explore more horror games. But I'd also like to... I'd also like to go back to some other games. Because uh, I didn't... I didn't finish Thymeshia, and I didn't finish, like, no, and, uh, what is it? Remnant never got a part two. And now Remnant 2 is out, so I have to finish Remnant 1. I gotta, like, speed run it. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, like, speed run the game and beat it in one go. So, like, you know, I, I never finished those games. So there's, there's a lot. There's a lot of stuff, you know. There's a few things. If you like horror RPGs, and I think you'd also like Fear and Hunger. It's a, it's also really challenging too. Fear and Hunger. Oh, thank you for the soup, Mia. Whereas RPGs, and I'd also Fear, Fear and Hunger. Huh, I've never heard of it. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Interesting. I've also heard about another kind of spooky one that's kind of like a Souls-like, but it's it's 2, 2, 2D Blasphemous. That one also looks kind of interesting. There's a lot of games, dude. There's a lot of games. So, we have a lot of things to think about. But really quick, I want to read these. I would like to read these. Because um, I know that there were a few that I missed. Uh, let me see. Uh, Luna, thank you for the soup, uh, uh, Karis, thank you for the super. Jairus, thank you for the super. Luna, thank you for the super. Edgarvin, thank you for the super. Mundane, thank you for the super. Almond Pocky, thank you for the super. Huh, Vantacrow, fearless bringer. That's what I am. Fear therapy is good. Well, I hope you guys can can if 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 you don't if you struggle with horror games, I hope that. Uh, my my uh, my approach to them can be a bit uh, can can help you because really uh, like to be perfectly honest with you guys I didn't always like horror games I actually avoided them like the plague because I didn't used to um uh, I didn't think that I was I was like nah they're not scary I was like I'm not how do you get scared of a video game like I didn't get it at first um, but I think I wasn't getting scared of horror games at first because I didn't immerse myself in them. Um, and I feel like that's what makes horror games what they are. Because whether you find them scary or not, I think what's valuable about them is that it's it's literally a different form of storytelling. Like they use lighting, they use music, they use, you know, design to really, really, really hit home like a certain point and to ingrain a sense of fear into you. However, if you understand that, then it's not nearly as scary. But what makes it scarier is by you know, really immersing yourself in the world. If you really put yourself in the shoes of your character, it is scary. It is. You know, there are things that you don't understand. You know, fear of the unknown is real. So like, it's it's real. It's super real. And thank you for the gifted, gifted Pong. Thank you so much for the gifted memberships. I can suggest the game. I think you'd enjoy Little Misfortune. I need to make a community post, but thank you for the super and for and for that, Luna, for that suggestion. Anna, thank you for the super. Thank you so much. I'd also like to recommend the old RPGs like The Hanged Man or IB or Aoyoni. Oh, I've never heard of those. Thank you for, for, for the super. Huh. There's a lot of things I haven't touched yet. Yeah, I don't know. I've seen The Quarry, but Until Dawn sounds like it might be fun. <laughs> Honestly, I, 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 yeah, you know what? You know, you know, okay, 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 okay. We're gonna, we're gonna discuss the future of this. I'll ask you guys for suggestions, but yeah. Okay, we're, we're gonna, we're gonna stop this for now. I, I need to read these. I will read these now. Uh, Dizzy, thank you for the super. Luna, thank you for the super. Aspen, thank you for the super. Dizzy, thank you for the super. Shaco from <laughs> your full name, Shaco from League of Legends, thank you for the super. Call me, call me, thank you for the super. Karis, thank you for the super. Are you an artist because you're really good at drawing me in? I think I I read this one in my brain and I laughed, but I was in the middle of a moment and I was like, ah. Oh. Nami Kinami, thank you for the super. Lucy, thank you for the super. I hope you're doing well too. Pog. It's me barking. I'm sorry. <laughs> thank you for the super, Ria. Yeah. Kiara. The fact that I listened to his stream in my class while the teacher told me to do my assignment. Hey, that's dangerous. And and hey, make sure you pay attention. School is important. School is important. 
Okay. School is very important. I hope your grades aren't suffering. But thank you so much for the super. But hey, don't, don't, don't sacrifice schooling. School is very, very important. Dizzy, thank you for the super. I recommend the mortuary assistant. Yeah, I've mortuary assistant looks looks sick. I I want to I want to revisit it to see the other endings and stuff because I've played it before. Also for the stream Vanta. Faith is a good horror series too, especially if you like retro style games. I love Faith. Do you want to know something funny? Faith was actually the game that got me into the horror genre. That was actually the first game that I played that got me into the horror genre, and I fell in love with horror after playing Faith. But I did not play all of Faith. And I know that there's like multiple parts and I think the game isn't even over yet. Aren't they still adding more to the game? Aren't they still adding more to it? Cause I haven't played the whole thing. I know that there's like, isn't there like three parts or something like that? I think maybe, I don't know that or I did play it all. But thank you for the super alpaca. Um, Nemes, thank you for the super. Henrietta Mint, thank you for the super. Amapaki, thank you for the super. And then yes, these were more recent. So I read these, fantastic. All right, we are all caught up. Oh, and also, <laughs> let me see. Uh, donations as well. Um, Killy, thank you for the donation. Random guy, thank you for the donation. Hey who, thank you for the donation. Jazz, thank you for the donation. And I cannot read your name, but thank you for the donation. I'm not sure what language that is, but thank you so much. <laughs> Random guy. Hey, that's their name, okay? I'm reading the name that they logged. Too late, instructions unclear. I'm now a college dropout. <laughs> What the fuck, Jairus? How do we get here? Thank you for the soup, but what the heck? <laughs> what the heck? Is... What is going on? freaking way you can't do this you can't do this okay uh, oh okay i wait i don't have i have an f boy laugh do i <laughs> no way nobody's ever told me that i feel like i have one kind of like like i can do one <laughs> <laughs> you want to you want to hear an actual f boy laugh? Here you go. <laughs> That's a fuck boy laugh. That's a fuck boy laugh right there. I think I do. Ha I have multiple laughs. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I feel like I have I have laughs for different scenarios. My my laughs my laugh changes depending on this on on what calls what's called for. Sometimes I have a super gremlin laugh. Sometimes I have like a really loud like boisterous laugh. Sometimes I just laugh like really really high pitch with a high pitched voice and it's just. Oh my gosh. Universe, thank you for the super. Thank you for the stream, Benton. Thank you. Happy birthday, Hazy, my friend. Oh, are you asking me to say happy birthday? Happy birthday, Hazy. And thank you for the super, Fubo Fubo. We went back for atmospheric space horror. We went back to where? Archeron, thank you for the super. So that was cute boy laugh. Wait, really? That wasn't a fuck boy laugh? Really? I. <laughs> <laughs> and you just, you just like you, you they're clapping their hands together <laughs> that's
that's a fuckboy laugh right there. That that is it. That is it. That's the fuckboy laugh. <laughs> it's so gross. I love it though. That one's like super intentionally gross. <laughs> Thank you, Kaido, for the super. <laughs> Nah, that's that's not Ren's laugh. I like you could say you could say Ren Senpai has has a fuckboy laugh all you want, but I actually like it. I feel like he has a lot of bass to his laugh, and despite sounding like a fuckboy laugh, it still sounds genuine. There's there's still a hint of genuineness in his laugh. It's still there. It's still very present. You can tell that he's actually laughing. Whereas I feel like a fuckboy laugh is very fake. I know I I have one I know one person one person. That has a, that has a genuine fuckboy laugh where it does not sound genuine at all, but that is their laugh. I feel like I feel like I can hear I can hear genuineness in Ren Senpai's laugh, so I feel like it's it's one it's it's a better it's a better laugh despite being his fuckboy laugh. But no, literally. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Can I borrow your cell phone? I need to call animal control because I just saw a fox. <laughs> Thank you for the super dollar levels. That's amazing. That's a good one. Not you trying to F-boy laugh like Red. What do you mean? What do you mean? That's 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 my best impression. I feel like I feel, I mean, there's another one. It's like it's like ha 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 ha. <laughs> you know, it's like really soft. The softer the laugh, I feel like the more F-boy it is because the more forced it sounds. The laugh has to feel incredibly forced for it to for it to be an F-boy laugh. You know what I'm saying? It's like ha 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 ha. It has to feel forced. It has to feel fake. The laugh has to feel like not genuine to be like a full-on fuckboy laugh, I feel like. <laughs> And then the lip bite to pull it together. It's terrible. Thank you for the supas. <laughs> Benji, did you know that scuba divers rolled off backwards? Rolled off backwards the boats because if they roll forward, they would go into the boat? <laughs> That's not information that I was aware of, but thank you for the super. Thank you for letting me know, Haya. <laughs> Do you know e e Ishbol? I just burst out laughing. I've never. Is did you just made you just made that up? There's no way that's a real acronym, Ria. But thank you for the super. <laughs> what is this, Vento? You know the difference between a cap and you is that I can take the cap off my head, but you, aha. I don't get it. I don't know. It's that I could take the cap off my head, but you. Ha ha ha. But. But not you. I can take the cap off my head, but not you. Oh, oh, like I'm like, I'm on. Oh, I see. Okay. I get it now. I get it. I get it. I get, I understand. Like I, you can't get me. I, I get it. I like it. I like it. Thank you for the memo, by the way. Welcome to the Venta crew. Yeah, I needed a minute. I really did. I was struggling out here. Okay. That's my bad. That's my bad. <laughs> <laughs> like I can take the cap off my head, but not you. Like I can take, I can take the cap off of my head. There's no way to explain that. I can't, I, my, my vocabulary is dead. Can you smile for the camera? Want to show my mom her future son-in-law. <laughs> <laughs> Sheesh. You know what that makes me think of? That makes me think of, um, uh, what's it called? Hey, don't I, don't I know you? It's like, no, I don't, I don't think you do. I, what are you talking about? Remember when you remember when you drunkenly stumbled into my apartment? Uh, you don't remember that? When did this happen? 
this weekend. Sheesh. Sheesh. That's a good one. Huh, that one's powerful. I've only seen that used like once. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Haya, for the for the gifted member. So you have severe Ejboltis? Okay, I just learned what that meant, but I don't I don't know. Ejbolt No. I just burst out laughing. Oh. <laughs> Ejbolt. <laughs> I've never heard of this. What is this slang? This got to be messed up. This has got to be messed up. There's no way. There's no way. <laughs> what? Ishbol, Ishbol. <laughs> it's supposed to be just like LMAO. <laughs> what? <laughs> Honestly, Ishbol sounds like a more honest version of LMAO. Because if you type in LMAO, it's likely you didn't actually laugh your ass off. Um, you probably just like breathed a bit more air out of your nose than normal. But Ishbol, you actually have to take some effort to type that out, you know? Unless you have like a hotkey. But you actually had to type out Ishbol. So like you clearly honestly just burst out laughing. Although at this point, I assume that a key that a keyboard smash is pretty honest. I feel like you're being pretty honest about how how funny how funny something was if you actually just keyboard smashed. <laughs> I don't know. Thank you for the stream. Normally I do not watch streams often, but your speech is easy to understand, so it was fun. Thank you for your hard work today. Ah, thank you so much for the super. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. I'm glad I'm easy to understand. I try to I try to talk, uh, you know, prim and properly. But yeah, I don't know. But yeah, I feel like each bowl is a, is a lot tougher to type. You, you've you committed to that each bowl, you know? So you really want that person to know that you actually just laughed. Like, that's a real honest laugh to me. I feel like that is. Oh, they apologized for their English in, in that in that super. Thank you for letting me know. Your English was perfectly fine, by the way, Rain. Your English was perfect. It was perfect. It was great. Thank you for letting me know. I appreciate that. But yeah, we have a lot. We have a lot of things to go over. I'm, I'm, there's a lot of things in my mind. I'm like, hmm. Ah, Ria, thank you for the member. Thank you for the member. Huh. Huh. I see, I see. <laughs> I'm learning so much today, but yeah, okay. So here's the deal, all right? Here's the deal. I need to make a community post, and you guys need to tell me. You guys need to tell me about games. You guys need to tell me about horror games, because I need to compile a list so that I can know. Because there's a lot of stuff. I haven't played a lot of horror games. There's only a very f small amount that I've played. Like, I... Okay, so to be perfectly honest, I did start Madison, like, a long time ago. But I did not finish it. I did actually didn't even get close to finishing it, I don't think. So, uh, I, I don't even remember what happened, if I'm being perfectly honest with you. Um, like, I started I, I started Madison forever ago. Like, like near, near when it came out. Uh, and then I, like, never finished it. Uh, and then there's a lot more that I haven't played. I've played Little Nightmares. I've played a Mortuary Assistant, and that's the, those are pretty much the only ones that I'm familiar with. I haven't played too much horror. Ah, thank you for the gifted member. Thank you for the gifted. I appreciate it. Eventa, have you ever been to jail? Because it should be illegal to be that good looking. Sheesh. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. You know what? We need we need that we need that we need that Riz class ASAP. We need that Riz class. I feel like there's quite a few people in here that know. There's quite a few people in here that know the deal. Know the deal. Thank you, Dizzy, for the super. Huh. Okay. All right. Well, I like it. I say I think I think we can stop here comfortably. But now I know what to do. I have some things I have some things to talk about with a few people, namely you you all. I'd like to take you to the movies, but they don't allow you to bring snacks in. Oh. 
<laughs> Alright, Luna. Sheesh, <laughs> thank you for the super. I'm like, um, I'm never gonna recover. That The Riz stream is gonna be wild when it ever happens. I like this. Okay. Alright, alright. We'll have to make something. You owe me money. You can't keep living in my head rent-free. <laughs> Cherries, thank you for the super. You guys are losing your minds. I'm... <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm stopping. Thank you guys so much for all the generosity today, and thank you for all the uh, for all the riz, all the riz that flows throughout this stream. We're gonna we're gonna make the Vanta crew the the most uh, the the community with with the most rizzlers. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna be full of rizzlers. We're gonna be full of rizzlers. We're gonna be the Vanta rizzlers. We're gonna be we're gonna be we're gonna be full of so much riz that people are gonna call us the Vanta Rizzlers. We're gonna be we're gonna be the Vanta Rizzlers. We're still gonna be the Vanta crew, but people are gonna refer to us as the Vanta Rizzlers because of how much riz we have. The Riz crew. Because we're unstoppable. But okay, we will stop for now. Um, who am I sending you to? Or is there no one on? Wait. Ah, dang. Okay. Okay. All right. I guess some things still need to be fixed. We're still new. <laughs> uh, thank you for the member. Welcome. But okay, we will stop for now. Um. So. Yeah, I, I don't really know. Um, I, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I am. Un, I am unable to. So we will. We will just stop. Uh, find your way to wherever you think you want to be. I appreciate you for hanging out with me. You're probably the most rizzless human alive. Nope, that's not true. And I'll prove it to you. I can prove it to you. I can prove it to all of you. Thank you for the super, yeah, yeah, son. But okay, we will stop here. I will see you all. Tomorrow on Zally's stream, Zal on Zally's channel, we will be we will finally be doing the friendship quiz that we had to delay last week. We had to postpone it last week because I was sick. So, yes, we will be breaking here. But yeah, I'll see you tomorrow at 2 p.m. PST for for on Zally's channel for the friendship quiz. So yeah, yeah, I am definitely better now. I think my throat hasn't recovered fully just yet, but. I'm definitely feeling a lot better than I did on that day. That day was terrible. But alright. Um, yeah, you guys have a good one. Have a fantastic rest of your day, evening, morning, night, what have you. I'll see you later. Hasta la bye bye.